Yeah. I, I, it sounds better when you do it in centimeters. It's just eight inches. You know, you know, when somebody says yeah. you want eight inches, you know, how about I give you fucking two four times? Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> Did I do the math yeah. right? Yeah, I think so. Whatever. Uh, hey, what's up, everybody? My name is Dust Mites, and welcome to Beers and Bullshits, the ROC hangout where we let our hair down, kick back a little bit, get some cocktails, and just chill out and talk and hang with you guys. Uh, you know, I have one, one, one major rule is that we don't talk robots and toys, but yeah, we may get into a little something about that, you know, but we do talk toys. We talk collecting habits and whatnot and old school memories, giving you guys out there a little bit of us, a chance to know us, get to know us, get to know us a little bit more. Get to know Russ the Musk. We get to know right Rust the Must, you know. So this is a chance for letting you guys into our world, even though I mean we let you guys into our world every time we do a show, but this is kind of different. I like this concept, uh, something that I experimented with, and I've been getting some good feedback. So I try to do it every so often. Yes, we know there was a convention with robots today, and there's some new stuff to talk about. But we got Monday night on Enter the Realm, and then we have Tuesday night's hangout talk to the hangout crew because if you could look at the panel right now we don't have the whole crew here so oh. i wanted to get everybody together so we could discuss uh the tfcon together so james is not here victory saber 77 is on vacation shout out to him and his family he's kicking it back at the lake house much needed relaxation so i figured we got the time slot open let's do something let's just Hell do yeah. something man yep. so sounds good so fuck it, we're here, man, and I think I rambled on a little too much right now. So I'm just gonna go left to right on my Google Hangout screen because that's what all the cool kids do, and uh, introduce one of our panel members right now. G Money's in the house. What's up, everybody? How's it going tonight? All right, By the way, that's double E. Awesome. Double E. Glad we can make it out today. It's good. Yeah. What's going on, man? Not, not a whole lot. Did a bunch of stuff around the house today. Uh, wifey was working and then had uh, plans with some girlfriends after work, so it's pretty nice. <laughs> yeah, yeah she's right. some drinks after cracking that whip. <laughs> Nothing better. So, yeah, so it's good. It's been, been, been a pretty decent day. Got a lot of stuff done. So, you know you're getting old when you feel that you're excited about getting your, your laundry caught up and, and getting your food prep for the week. <laughs> Definitely. Code up, huh? I just buy new shit. I buy new underwear. I buy a new shirt. I buy some new pants. When I move out of here, it's gonna be a lot of throwing shit out. That's for sure. <laughs> well, I'm not buying robots, so I gotta buy something. <laughs> I'm the only dude out there that is fucking PayPal credit fucking limit got raised, and there's nothing I want. <laughs> Oh, okay. Continuing on, Hurricane BX. Jose, what's up, man? Yo, what's up, everybody? Happy Saturday. Cheers. What's up, Mr. Hey, Overtime? Yeah. yeah. Uh, <laughs> here's a happy Saturday, you can. <laughs> yeah, um, I'm chilling, man. I had a good day. I had uh, I worked earlier and had some overtime, which was, uh, it was pretty slow, so it was very easy. And uh, came home, spent the afternoon with the wife, chilled out, and uh, now I'm here having a drink with you fellas. Nice. nice. Thanks for that. Yeah. All right. Now that your intro is done, you can back out, come back in, see your camera's not blocked out. No doubt. <laughs> You're on some JD <laughs> shit right now. Okay. Okay. <laughs> hey, man, it's, this is beers and bullshit. We just fucking don't hold it back. We're just going to let it out. Yeah. Say, fuck it. What are you drinking there, G Gary? G Money, what do you got there? Uh, I got a little cap yeah, a little Captain Morgan and some, some coke. Oh, you did go. Oh, we I almost did. had to change the name of the show to uh coffee and bullshit. Oh no, look, I made both because this is it gets it might get late for me, so I've got a coffee sitting here too just in case. But nice. I figure I'd start with the beverage. Nice. Yeah. And when Jose comes back, we're gonna ask him what he's sipping on. And next up. Nice. Look at this dude. You're supposed to be packed and ready to move. You got one day <laughs> left. What the fuck is going on behind you? I got a week left. What are you talking about? Uh, I thought, well, you, you made that big post like three days left. Three. Or, or three, oh, for that work. Was, that was for work. Yeah, my last day of work was on Wednesday. Now yeah, I got to unemployment. You have no Dude. job and you don't know where the fuck you're going to live. Nope. Well, I do know where I'm going to live, actually. But after that, uh, I got to figure it out. <laughs> Kenny, I got to admit, your, your display looks great, but I do not envy you having to pack all that stuff up. Yeah, it's not <laughs> I bought, I bought six more totes today, so hopefully I can get all the Transformers in them anyway. I've got plenty of regular cardboard boxes, but 
they're going to be in it for a little bit, so I want them to actually have like a like an actual plastic home. Uh, you know what? They're chugs, so you can just chug them right into the fucking dumpster. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! Oh. Speaking of chugging, uh, oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Hey, um, but but Kenny, what the fuck is your Carnifex doing? That's a, <laughs> that's cool. I, I, man. So I'm not a box guy. I'm not a box guy like a lot of uh, people are. But I do have his box and a few other boxes. So if I'm gonna be taking those because they already have accessories and stuff, I'm just gonna put them into the box instead of the tote. Yeah. Ah, cool. The yeah, idea. Yeah. All right. So anybody that doesn't know, Tommy is oh, Tommy. Well, I'm looking at the chat. Someone said Tommy, and I'm thinking Tommy. Uh, Kenny is going home. I'm going home back to Rhode Island. All right, so you went from Rhode Island to where are you at now? Indianapolis. For a job opportunity, right? Uh, something like that. <laughs> yeah, we're, we're, we're going to put the dirt out there. Not all the dirt, but a little dirt. We're just going to find out a little bit more about you because that's what we're doing here. That's cool. <laughs> you know, it wasn't a chick, was it? Uh, <laughs> oh fuck, Kenny! Come on, man. Yeah, <laughs> no. Ah. <laughs> Russ, you're the salt in the wound, man. I'm sorry, dude. I'm sorry. Uh, if it was a year ago, it would have bothered me, but I've worked through it. So. Yes, he's uh, passed it. Russ. I, I no. apologize. I'm sorry. Uh, I, I just, it just, uh, I'm trying to talk my son out of that shit. I'm afraid he's going to take off to another state for that same reason. So, you know. <laughs> <laughs> Hashtag pussy strong. Yeah. Uh, yeah. <laughs> That's about to say. Power that pussy. Power that, that, that pussy. Really? Uh, <laughs> that pussy strong. Hey, come, come on. Halfway across the country and shit. Damn. <laughs> oh, man. So, uh, so Kenny, now you're, you're wrapped up at work. You're heading back home. You're super excited. Yeah, yeah, I can't wait. I can't yeah, it wait seems like back home. I mean, I'll be I'll be in the driving distance of like NJCC, obviously TFCon in October. So mm -hmm. I'm hoping that I get a job and situated by that time so I can go. Um, yeah, I mean, I should be good. You're a you're a young dude with a resume. Yeah, I take Whatever. it. I take it you have some sort of degree also. No, no degree. No degree? Pimpology 101? Not even Pimpology? <laughs> 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 I don't funny. want to go there. I've always thought about, like, uh, I've had people... Hey, you got glasses. What the fuck? I've had people apply at, at my stores in the past that have, like, master's degrees, and they're applying for, like, seasonal positions for minimum wage. So whenever yeah, any jobs look for experience... I was, I was just trying to I've put a little notch part. in the belt there for you. Yeah, like, I've got that part. And I'm, I'm sure a lot of us have that part, and it's just it's too bad because I feel like degrees should be worth more than they are these days. And, and you know, I've done I've been pretty well with that one, but I feel bad for people that can't go into their view. Well, let me tell yeah. you a little something about degrees. And in, and in, I'm not I'm not saying my company, but they bring in a lot of these young bucks. You know, I've been with my company for about 10 years now. They bring in all these young bucks with degrees, and they're going to be the future. They're going to change things. They're going to make the company better. The young bucks. The last six months, because they realize in retail you have to work weekends, and you have mm. to close, and you're not going to see you your friends, it. and you're not going to see your girlfriend, and you're not going to yeah. do this. And you're actually got to do things and sweat and work and be messy and get things done. Yeah. And they leave. Yep. Exactly. And I'm going to tell you, man, the numbers are outrageous. You got dudes they're bringing in to be supervisors for this and that, giving them fucking uh, cars, company cars, and hooking them up with a company house and all this shit. And six months later, they're done. They're out. Yeah. yeah. Damn. Out. That's so what I like to think of, and this is just an old school, you know, you know, old school dust might say that promote from within because you have knowledge. You have um, people that know the business. They know yeah. the culture. Mm -hmm. You know, yeah. um, they may not have a degree, but fuck it. They know how to fucking sell shit and put shit on a fucking shelf and make money. Or they yeah. just see what the position brings because they see the people that are work that they're working with and they go, yeah, I want that or no, I don't want that. When you hire those people from, from the outside. Uh, the, there's definitely something to be said for some just good old fashioned work ethic as well. You know, yeah. and when and people put in the effort, then that shouldn't go unrecognized. Sure. Yeah. That's sure. it. And I'm not saying dudes out there with degrees get no. I'm not saying that at all. But nowadays it's a lot of it's a huge issue now that they're not ready for that work environment. No. You know? Hey hey yeah, Kenny, with, uh, I'm sorry, I, without asking too much info, um where what kind of work were you in in Indy? 
Um, I have been a store manager since I was 19. So I was okay. Yeah, a store manager actually. Dude, you're going to be fine. That that can apply to so many different scenarios. I, I think it's going to you'll you'll be fine. Yeah, I hope so. Uh, I feel pretty confident for somebody without a job and without anything lined up. Like I feel pretty good about it actually. So. Thank I you. feel pretty good with Kenny putting his fucking life story out there. Shout out to Kenny Prime. <laughs> it's awesome, dude. Thank you for sharing. About that. And shout out to my fucking chair that keeps losing air in the shock for the past year. And I should have bought a new one, but I didn't. Yeah, see, that's your PayPal credit. Yes. There you go. Exactly. Yes, I can buy a chair on PayPal credit, but you know what? It doesn't transform. It does transform. It goes lower and it goes higher. Yeah, you know what? Well, then maybe I won't wake up 5 a.m. after a fucking Enter the Realm show when I pass out in a chair and I'm not all the way down to the ground. <laughs> <laughs> you know, you don't want to see a fight. You want to see dust mites trying to get out of this chair when it's down at the ground at 5 a.m. I'm like, I'm like a turtle <laughs> on its fucking back. Don't make that fucking that. Hey, Kenny, mm -hmm. what, what are you sipping on? Or what were you sipping on? Um, I had a, a, a couple Sam Summers, and then uh, Uncle Dust just read my mind. So he knew I was at Applebee's without me saying anything. And then he knew I was picking the Yingling. So I was trying, I was trying Yingling on tap for the first time. Yeah, he so, sent me a text, and I'm like, I said, he's like, yeah, well, I'm, I'm on my way. I'm at some uh, establishment eating a steak. And at first of all, I'm like, I know he's not out at Applebee's eating a steak. <laughs> <laughs> so I was like, Applebee's, and he's like, "Yeah, you're right." I said, like, "Yingling, yeah, you're right." <laughs> <laughs> and uh, well, shout out to Kenny for giving me the new name, Uncle Dust. Uncle Dust. That my nephew hasn't given me the name, Uncle Dust, but it, it seems like it's been, been called a lot. So we're just gonna run with that today. It, it was something really cool, uh, um, and, and then we'll move on. I, I'm sorry to take the take the lead so much here. But dude, it's beers and bullshit. We can yeah, talk exactly. about exactly. <laughs> all the time. Yeah, I don't care if there's one viewer. We're hanging. We're, we're fucking we're we're hanging out. out. So we're my fun. last uh, my last day, um, my team calls me to the front and I think it's you know, just a normal thing. I have to help them out or whatever. Like can you to the front please? And I was like, all right. So I head up front and they're all just like staring at me and they're like, we hear it's your last day. Like they had like a script or something figured out. They got me a card that like moved me more than I thought would. And they got me a, a gift card to Logan's Roadhouse, which I had never heard of, but apparently there's one nearby, so I have to go there before I leave. Is but, that uh, where you get the <laughs> at a cheap rate? <laughs> <laughs> the Logan Roadhouse. You know, when I hear Logan's Roadhouse, I hear a lot of uh, <laughs> I've never been there. Um, it's a you know, I don't know. But uh, but yeah, they got me an eighty dollar gift card, so I'll probably get two meals there. Nice. Uh, but it's like like it's really bad. You know what I mean? Um, I've only can had. You can you do me a favor? Just put the mic closer to your mouth. You're getting kind of low on us. I don't know if it's your connection dipping or what. Uh, no, I have it to the bottom because it's really sensitive and I don't want to breathe into it. No, 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 no. It's okay. You can breathe in our face. This is, this uh, is I'd rather you breathe <laughs> and we could hear you other than <laughs> not hear you. Yeah. <laughs> but anyway, that was a little, a little part of that. Story. So it was pretty neat. It's pretty, you know, neat to have a team. Um, that's actually gonna miss me. So yeah, man, that's awesome, man. That's an awesome feeling. That's I get that yeah. a lot with with my people too. You know, it's a really good feeling. You like one of the guys today. Like I've been going in every every uh, Friday into Saturday morning to support my night team. And like oh, the one dude said today, he's like, like, I haven't told you. Like you know, in the past six weeks, you've been doing this seven weeks. Thank you very much. It's been it means a lot because I'm right next to these guys. You know, with them. You know. <laughs> Yeah, you're there to support them and help them get Packing better. Packing out and, and, and making things and getting them where, where, you know, and I got a team where they, they take pride in their work and they want to make sure at, at opening we look perfect. We're 100%. You know what I'm saying? So just yeah. like, and it, like I can see their disappointment when I come in and it's like, you know, they left stuff that needs to get done from the day crew. And it's like, you know, it's just like just to get in there and show them that I'm part of them. I'm, I was them. You know, it means yeah. a lot. And Absolutely. that's a big difference from being a boss and a leader. Yep. Yeah, right there. Oh, exactly right. Yep. You got it. I wrote a big long email that my uh, my boss was not a leader. Who's choking a frog? He doesn't work in that district anymore. <laughs> <laughs> all, all I hear is. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, he's got a good ratchet. He's yeah. a good ratchet over there somewhere. Who's fucking fixing their exhaust on a car? <laughs> 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 Who is that? 
If you, he, 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 he's got, he's got a fans to toys to toy. Who's playing with fans <laughs> toys? <laughs> <laughs> hey, when you when you hear what I think you're hearing, it is this. Oh. Oh shit. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, of, of course, course it's fucking you. Tim. Of course. <laughs> <laughs> of course. I thought Russ had a good, uh, good, you know, shoulder ratchet over there. Fidget, or something. Fidget, yeah, I know, right? Right? fidget spinners are a lot no less noisier. Russ with his stomach on Tiva, like all the ratchets. Said, oh yeah, it works so nice. great. You know what? Do me a favor. See that shelf all the way back behind you. Put it on there real quick. Will you? <laughs> <laughs> So, Kenny, uh, are you sipping on anything now? Uh, I'll, I'll get a, a Coors Light in a second. Ooh, a Coors like Light? Going from, going from the Yingling and Sam Adams to the Coors Light. I like Coors Light. Yeah, you know, make it a lot of crap, but I like it. Yeah, yeah, shout out to that girl. Uh, Jose, we have to come back to you. What are you sipping on? Uh, I'm drinking vodka. Mm, look at that. Uh, Good old vodka. vodka? Uh, orange vodka? What is in that? Was that mixed no, with tea? Granny's old tea? Uh, pea? <laughs> Whatever Lex Luger said in the show. Was it Lex Luger? <laughs> Lex Luger? It's Crystal Light. It's like an Arnold Palmer. So half lemonade, oh, half Crystal ice tea. Light, huh? Nice, nice. It's cold. It's I got summer. to watch the calories, man. I got to watch the calories. Yeah. All right. The longest intro ever. Yep. Pretty much. So, it's fun stuff, man. All right. <laughs> Russ the Must is next. What up, Russ? What's up, guys? Russ. How you doing, man? I'm, I'm hating on old people right now. That's my thing. That's my whole stick right hey, now. Hey, man, you know what? Everybody's letting it go, so let's get a Rust okay. the Must rant live yeah, here. Let's on do it. Let's <laughs> Look, here's the deal. I, I've never been against old people driving, okay? But you're fucking 68 years old. Hold on, can't. hold on, hold on. Send any hate mail to <laughs> Rust the Must. <laughs> <laughs> all right, let's continue. If you fucking can't drive, get the fuck off the road. That's all I'm saying. By the uh, way, I don't know this dude. Yeah, man. <laughs> hey, but for real, but for real, Russ, it's like that. They can't even walk straight. They can't even get out of the fucking car, but they have a car and they're driving shit. Not, o not only yeah. that, but they have to select like the largest car or minivan or you know gigantic sedan. It's at least clearly, clearly. yeah. yeah. <laughs> Model four, exactly. Guys, What's frightening is this guys. Is I'm <laughs> almost that guy, okay? I uh, know, yeah, right? <laughs> Dust is there soon. <laughs> <laughs> no, you're know, not. Man, she, she was driving like a little Corolla, too. That's what, that's what was shocked oh, me. I was surprised. <laughs> it was a little Corolla, you know? And my wife's car is small, you know? She got a little, it's a little tiny car already, too. And I'm like, God damn. It's pink. I, uh, yeah, don't. I'm not saying that. Yeah, <laughs> don't just right here. She already yelled at us. I'm not, yeah. I'm not saying that. <laughs> No, 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 Anna. It's okay. <laughs> anyway, no. well, but I'm just you like, know, you know, damn, first off, is Anna okay? Yeah. She's all right. Yeah, that, she, it wasn't like good th the good thing. You know, it wasn't a hard hit or nothing. She just the lady went to went to pass went to get by Anna because I think she thought Anna was gonna or was gonna keep merging and Anna stopped because she had to wait to let this other guy go by and and she didn't stop and she kind of misjudged trying to pass her and you know it was kind of like a corner hit a corner you know what I mean that kind of thing. I don't know. It, 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 I just know the car looks all smashed on one corner of it. So I'm pissing I'm, me off. I'm, I'm trying as hard as I can to leave the fact that you said Anna got a hard hit. <laughs> 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 I'm just trying to leave that alone, man. <laughs> yeah, you officially did. You know oh, what I am. Man. <laughs> nah, yeah, I'm, just, I'm, I'm just very. I saw the picture on Facebook and I'm like, oh, fuck. Yeah. You know, bad enough yesterday I saw the sunburn and then this. It's like Yeah, she she's having a rough week, a rough week off, you know. <laughs> you know, I'm just I'm just fucking happy as fuck that, you know, I'm not the only one. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I mean the good I mean my daughter was with her too in the car, which I'm glad you know, I'm glad it was nothing major, you know what I mean? It's just it's yeah. just not just the aggravation of having to, you know, put the car in a shop. Yeah. Get it fixed, all that dumb shit. Yeah, that's what down from, to. From the look the of, but at least from the look of the damage, it's still drivable. Oh yeah, it is. It is. It just so, you know, it's not yeah. like you know, you, you're like I can't get to work because right, my bump right. is pushing or the yeah. you know, my fucking wheel is gone. Yeah, no, we, we've <laughs> we've had those situations with vehicles before too. So I, I'm, you're right. I'm. It could be always worse. So I guess you got to look at that. You know, look at it that way. But 
All right, Russ, but, what are you drinking on? Some Geritol tonight? What, what's going uh, on? Tonight? Man, I ain't drinking nothing. I'm trying to, I got some Pepsi, uh, cherry Pepsi. That's all I got. You know what, but Dust, I need some alcohol, though. You know, I may go get an alcoholic beverage because I need it. <laughs> I, don't, I, I don't want you to ask to wait to TFCon DC for that shit, man. Oh, God. <laughs> Jesus. I oh, don't know, man. So all right. Like, Nick. Anyway. <laughs> We're going to move on to Tim, but before we move on to Tim, anybody out there that wants to be on the panel, just hit me up. Hit me up on Facebook Messenger or Instagram DM or whatnot. I will send you the link to the show. We'll get you up in here, and we will make fun of you. Prefer, uh, I was say, that's a big word. I'm, I'm, trying to, I'm counting them down. One, two, three, four. I'm at eight right now, peeps, so eight. Right wow. Now, damn. Ooh, yeah, you're, damn. Well, I started late. Usually, usually, usually it'd be like 12 <laughs> by now. I, I took a little nap. I didn't get up off the couch until about 7.15, so Ooh. we started a little late. Is that, is that the couch that talks to you? Yes. <laughs> it's the shark couch, man. It's the shark couch, man. Shout out to Jaws. Uh, but again, um, remember, guys, I've been up since fucking 2.30 a.m., so. Yeah. He's chatted that. Did, 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 did you get a good, good rest, man? No, I didn't sleep at all. I was on the fucking couch. Just, you were just laying there. Didn't sleep, though. I can't sleep. That's not I, a I, I sleep. What's up, Ken? Are you still having problems sleeping? Yeah, of course, man. I've always had problems sleeping. My Are whole you like insomniac and shit? Yeah, you know, on and off. It used to be really bad earlier when I was really young, but um, I, I've been through it all, man. I've been through sleep studies, like fucking Ambien, and they put yeah. me on. Oh, here's a story. Here's a dust my story. Back in the day, they put me on this some shit because Ambien wasn't working, and I wasn't right. getting sleep. I was up three, four days in a row. They gave me this shit called Terrazidone. Hmm. I don't know if you guys ever had terazidone. No. All right. The doctor said, this is going to work. All right. And this wasn't it. It was my old place. I, I took it in the, in the bathroom, right? Took it, finished up, cleaned up, whatever. I don't know, maybe a minute and a half tops. By the time I was walking towards the fucking bedroom, shit was like. Oh, wow. <laughs> My ass was like do 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 boom done out and I was like I couldn't take it no more I was like man that's it's too intense man I can't I can't fuck with that so I sold it so I sold the prescription for like one fifty nice nice guapped up on that doctor drink your ass and shit nah man I've never had you know I've I've had like you know in Sleep aids, Unisom and Tylenol PMs, and where it helps you put you out a little bit more. I never felt this experience before, and I'm just like, you know what? I, I don't like it. I'm not fucking with it. it. I don't feel comfortable with this. So I'll, I'll never be a. I'll be a drunk, but I won't be a drug addict. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's crazy, though, man. Yeah, that's, that's a little sidebar story, man. I got stories for days, man. <laughs> Beers and bullshit. Hey, Welcome, let me let me help you sleep. I'm gonna knock you the fuck out for yeah, two. Well, you know what? He, here's my work schedule this week. Um, Wednesday I go home normal time. I'm home by five. Uh, Thursday is my Thursday morning is my one night I can sleep in because I have to close that night. So I get about eight or nine hours sleep if I'm lucky. I'm still up at eight o'clock, so I try to go to bed as early as possible. You know, that's why I like like finger banging. I'm just like. Psh, 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 psh. You know, because I want to still get into bed, try to get at least nine hours so I can recharge. That's my one recharge day. Mm -hmm. And then I close Thursday. I get I leave about 11. I get home by about 11, but I can't just fall asleep. I'm not that dude to just come home right. and be like, yeah, I'm going to yep. bed. No, no, no. I'm, I'm worked up. I work 10 hours. I'm all, you know. Still needs to get that me time in, you know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll watch yeah. some YouTube videos. I'll play some fucking Friday Thirteenth. You know, drink some seltzer, have some pretzels, whatever. You know, just Next bringing you down. down. Yeah, yeah. I I go to lay yeah. down in bed. It's like probably about twelve thirty. Yeah. And then it's like one. Then I look. Oh fuck! SCU just dropped. Fuck! All right, let me play SCU while I sleep. <laughs> And I'll listen to Shattercast and cut a little bit, and I'll start laughing. The next thing you know, I'm up till 2. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because you listen to the whole show. Yeah, and I'm, I'm like, really fuck bad. this. I, got, I finally got to say, I got to lay down. I click it. I shut the shit off. Finally fall asleep. 
4 30 that alarm rings man i'm just like a fucking zombie so wow. shout out to shattered cast yeah for keeping me up every <laughs> thursday night when i should be sleeping yeah <laughs> cocksuckers yeah they have a way of doing that <laughs> <laughs> i never had any sleeping problems until the job that i just left like i like the past two or three days since I've left, I mean, I'm still waking up crazy early. I'm still dead tired in the middle of the day, and I'm like falling asleep at home because I'm just, like they just fucked me up. Yep. Yeah. You, you'll get through that. Yeah, so I then, so. so then I don't sleep on Thursday. I gotta be in bright and early on Friday. Usually, I get there at six. So then, Friday, I get home about five that that Friday. But then Saturday, I got it's my three a.m. day. You know, right now. So it's like Thursday all the way until when I get out on Saturday is like one big, one big yeah, day. It's one shift. It's one compressed one big day, you yeah. know? Yeah. And it just, it, it just fucking, it, it kills you after a while. And like, I'm getting used to it, but I don't want to do it no more. You know, I just yeah. want to be able to chill. Like, who the fuck's in bed on a Friday night at fucking 730? This guy. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I'm I'm watching some TV or whatever, and I'm fucking on, you know, fucking around on the phone. But air conditioning is on, blinds are down, curtains are closed, blankets up, Wookie's chilling. You know what I mean? Yeah. You know, it's 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 that's not a lifestyle to have. So, but hopefully, I'm almost done with that bullshit. I'm just, you know, I mean, I don't have to do it, and that's the thing that gets me. Is like I don't have to do it. I want to do it, and it's I don't want to do it for me, but I want to do it for my team. So. So that's Keep why watching. when Saturday comes and I'm all fucking, <laughs> and you throw a couple of these guys in there. <laughs> Best idea all day. Uh, equals uh, dust <clears> on <throat> the <of> fanatics. <laughs> <laughs> and, um, and that's kind of like you know, ETR night's kind of like that too. It's like, um, I go in super early. I come home and there's. You know, getting news together, getting shit together, getting starting to show up, getting the pre-show, and then hang doing the show, and then you know, and then there's the hangout afterwards, and then you know, it, that's another long day too. But yeah. thankfully, that's why I have my day off on Tuesday. That's basically why we do the show on Monday. Shit. Yeah, that way if you that way if you're up late one day, you ain't got to worry about getting up for for Tuesday. Yeah. Yep. I understand. That's helpful. See, like, I always tend to forget, and, I, and we just had a discussion with the crew. like, you know, I'm the only one that has this type of lifestyle. You know, everybody has families and whatnot. People get up right. early. People do things. But, you right. know, I live my lifestyle a crazy way, so it works out. And on that note, let's talk to Tim. We're still on intros. I have I know. Already. We're still on intros. <laughs> but you know what? Not one what you get. No, because we're not talking it. about what you get. We're talking <laughs> exactly. about what we do in our lives. So, Tim, you got live it. from Germany. Yeah, baby. What's up? Everyone good? What is up, oh. Tim? What's What's up? Good. good to hear. No, all good. I'm just kicking back a little on my second to last day of vacation, sipping some gin tonic, hanging with you guys. Hey, Tim, what are you drinking? That's a gin tonic. That is a... Right. Uh, that's a you, little you were supposed to wait till I ask you. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't know if you didn't wait or if you weren't paying attention. Okay, rub those roots in my face, man. <laughs> no, it's, not, it's, just, it's just a mix. It's a London dry gin and some Thomas Henry tonic water, some lime, and some ice cubes. Nice. Shout out to yeah. Ice Cube. Exactly. So, uh, yeah, pretty good. Little hang back, easy day, relaxing. All good. It's your vacation, man. What time is it over there right now for you? It is currently 3.30 a.m. Wow, 3.30 a.m. Shout out to this dude. 3.30 yep. a.m. Hang it tough. Hang it tough. I'm here complaining about going to work. and you know, you, you're, you're, you know what? You're hanging out on a hangout at the same time I woke up last night. Exactly. God, damn, <laughs> did you, did hey. you take a nap during the day? What's that? Tim? Uh, no, ac actually not. I'm I'm trying to keep it up now, and also on the Sunday. Oh, easy. I try to, I try to be up. <laughs> <all the week>. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you may want to rewind on that one. <laughs> <laughs> I said, <laughs> I said no, I didn't. Um, I will try to be up <laughs> on Sunday, so I can sleep better. Because um, funny stuff, uh, Eddie. What you said when the doctors uh, hooked you up on that stuff. Um, my doctors tried that too. I have pretty severe sleeping problems from Sunday to Monday too. 
but uh, German doctors are not so easy on getting you sleeping pills or any stuff whatsoever. So they hook you up with that nature shit, Valerian. <laughs> <laughs> they need your shit. Oh, no. <laughs> hey, you know what? I'm gonna tell you guys right now. Melatonin. Okay. Melatonin. It's 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 yeah. it's in the vitamins and herb area. You take a couple of yep. them. Okay. It, it what helps. it does, it, it puts it puts your um puts you. Oh, I can't even fucking remember. It's it just puts <sighs> you like... into an ease. It's not something that knocks you out. It doesn't make you sleepy, but. You know how you feel when it gets like dusk into eight, nine o'clock, you start <sighs> you get like that <laughs> shit, you know? You yeah. take a little of this, you get a little extra, yeah, like six when you take uh -huh. it, you know. Okay. A lot of people it, it's it's all natural. It there's is natural, no, yeah. yeah very there's no chemicals, it's no pharmacy, it's very popular. Yes. Um yeah. it's yeah, the problem is we probably won't get it from Germany because we have different different regulations on that. Mm. It is weird, yeah. My my sister in New Zealand she can't buy Neosporin. She needs a prescription for Neosporin. So she wants oh, me to be able to. Neosporin is, is free over here. So it's yeah, free. It's, yeah, it's, it's free. free. <laughs> 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 you can get it for, for five bucks. The one, thing of, the one only thing about this shit is it gives you the fucking craziest dreams ever. Melatonin? Okay. Yes. And yeah, you have, to give, yourself, you have yeah. to give yourself enough time. You got to have at least six hours to eight hours of sleep. Yeah, um, great. It, but the dreams, bro, it's like it's like a movie. It's like you like, <laughs> you know, you, you want to fucking watch a movie? Pop fucking three like ten milligrams, thirty milligrams of fucking melatonin. Wanna watch a movie? <laughs> you, you watch a movie. <laughs> it's fucking crazy. Uh, yeah, my sister got me to buy some of that since my my sleep problems. I still haven't even opened the bottle because I'm I'm afraid to take in anything. I'm no, like, I'm no, never taking it's, it's, I don't think, I'm never taking Advil. I don't take don't, pills. Don't think of it like like being it's it's not medicine. It's, right, it's it all true. natural. Yeah, I, hear I hear you. Yeah. It's all natural. Yeah. Um, um, it's it's just a lot of people like in my business. If you were if you start working overnights, and you come home and it's light out. If you take melatonin, it gets your body in that mode. When the sun goes down, right. your body your body is timed with the sun, and the orbits of the moon, and the stars, <laughs> and the space, and the fucking rainbows, and all that. Shit, you know, <laughs> so it gets you. It gets you. You get you more in tone with that melatonin. Get it, and it brings you down faster and gets you in that your REM sleep. It's just crazy on this mm. stuff, which is okay. why you dream heavy. Yeah. Yeah, if, yeah. I ever need, if I ever needed to sleep, I always usually just took like a time of PM and within an hour, I'm just drowsy. I want to go to bed. Or some of that Bram juice you sleep, you're drinking right now. I hear that the helps ice the process. Juice. <laughs> that helps the process. <laughs> yeah, but it hurts in the morning, man. It hurts in yeah. the morning. Yeah. You've down that, that really quick there. Look at you. It's yeah. good, man. It's good. Yeah. All right, that's my first screw, and it's empty, too. So I got right, we're, we're, ste we're stealing Tim's thunder here. We don't want to steal Tim's thunder. He stayed nah, up for a long time, man. So. Nah, that, that, that's good. That, that's pretty much for me. I, I, I am, I'm pretty much chilling. I got to refill soon. And so much for that. I'm good. All right. Tim, I see you put the earbuds in. Yeah. All right, do me a favor. I mean, I know you're still new to this. Uh, on the Google Hangout screen, you'll see a cogwheel on the top where it says settings. Yep. All right, click that, and then where your microphone goes, click yeah. that. Do you see, like, headphones or something like that? Um, I have uh, standards, communication, and microphone, which uses my uh, webcam normally. All right, so there's nothing about headphone or anything. No, it's uh, it's on an external clock. It's by uh, normal music headphones. Nothing much. What's the matter? No, because I'm just thinking it would. It, you're coming through your your webcam now, but it would sound probably a little bit more tighter if it came through that microphone that's right under your neck. Okay, that is interesting. Uh, because I put this up because I thought it would take the uh, microphone right away. No, it did. It didn't register the mic. Sometimes you got to set it. Okay, I, so, I actually play, 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 play with you. Come on, we got time, man. Who gives a fuck, man? Yeah, we're 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 fuck with you. <laughs> so let's go to the next setting. Click it and put, put hit save. Oh, doing it safe. So how about this now? Talk a little more. Yeah, I'm I'm talking a little more. This is no, uh, it's not, it sounds the same. All right, go to the next one. But you are uh, more lower. That's funny. So now I'm going to microphone, which says my webcam again. That's it now. That's so it now. You only have the two settings. 
I only have the two settings. The only okay. thing I can do more is a stamp. So this is that again. No, you know, it doesn't sound bad. Don't get me wrong. It doesn't sound terrible. We're just trying to yeah, you know, tighten it up. Yeah. I've, we've had a lot worse on here on all the hangouts. And the shows. <laughs> That's a fucking thing. <laughs> yeah, we had dudes fucking hanging out their car window, driving at 85 <laughs> miles an hour going, yo, what's up? <laughs> Shout out to the old yeah. school days, man. I miss those days, man. The only yeah, the man. only thing I can the only thing I could uh, try is actually going through my webcam, and I don't know how this works. So no, you, uh, you are coming through your webcam. Yeah, I, I mean, I mean, I could try go through the settings of my webcam to actually yeah, disable that. that Come on, man. No, 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 no. We'll do that on another time. You know, what you can do. You see that little phone up there? That's red. Yep. You can click that. No, don't make me. <laughs> <laughs> no way. No He's not that, he, he hasn't had that many drinks yet. <laughs> <laughs> what even happened if I have five? Man, I'm just trolling, I'm just trolling you guys tonight. Man. So, wow, wow so 39 right. minutes and we just got through the intros, man. Yeah, that's good enough. Hey, shout out to Uncle Dust. That's my new name right now. Beers. Beers a uh, beats bots beers, beers bots beats, whatever the fuck it is. Hey, but you don't stand it up like this and say, shout out to myself. <laughs> I told you right yeah, I'm sure. the last person to shout out myself. That's a fucking <laughs> <laughs> Anybody's I tried to fucking hide behind the shadows when that, that goes down, man. All right, man. That's intros. What that's a wrap, I guess. Yeah, man. There you go. Well, we got all right. We're done. What's your outros? <laughs> There's another 40 minutes. <laughs> Took a half of a damn show on intros. That's it. That's great. Shout out to the ROC hangouts. Yeah, I'm right. That's uh, it. Man. <laughs> I will say we've gotten better in the hangout at going a little faster for the intro, but it still takes a little longer sometimes. Well, that's because I'm always hitting the fucking Jose. Run it faster, run it faster. Yeah, <laughs> Dust is always like poking with a fucking prod. Move your ass. <laughs> you know, I may not be there, but I'm there. I'm the Ted Turner of this shit, man. I'm the move. Ted Turner of this shit. Dust is that fucking producer in the background going, move it, motherfucker, move it, move it. <laughs> Hey man, you know I think I think uh, we've been doing this enough. I think I got enough to you know. If I'm bored, motherfuckers are bored, so keep it moving. <laughs> oh man, I love this shit. Anyway, sorry. Winded, I'm like wrap it up. <laughs> yeah, no, no. Sometimes we, we, yeah, sometimes we'll get into something a little too long. It's like no, move on, come on. <laughs> okay, all right, well, here's a story for Tuesday. It's like you know. I was playing fucking some Friday the 13th. You guys were doing a show. We set up. Yeah. Dave was hitting me up. He's like, you know, Energy on Ag's like, yeah, man, we're, we're running out of steam here. And I'm like, yo, it's 920. <laughs> I, I, yeah, told, yeah. I, I told you guys you could go to 10 because, you know, I was playing the game. I was like, you know, I'll stay up a little bit. Then I'll go to bed. I know you guys like to go a little longer. It's like, ah, oh, man, I don't think we're going to make it. I don't think we're gonna make okay, it. but what's funny about that, Dust, is that we had just started a good conversation exactly, yeah. about the stunticons yeah. and shit, and about, about you know, and about all these different That's versions. That's why I need that update out. text, and I didn't get the update right. text. Communication, people. Uh -huh. Communication. Yeah, but but and, but I wrote that in the messenger. I wrote you that we, we could be longer. We just start the start of conversation. Nope. Yeah, I, I got that from you, but I got Dave saying this, and then Jose. Right. and then Jose didn't and he's know. Like, yeah, we're working through our outros. We're just about to wrap it up. I'm like, what the fuck? Yeah, I thought we're going to ten thirty, and then I, Dave's I, like, "Nah, man, we're not gonna make it." I'm like, uh, and I'm, totally, I'm over, totally I'm in the living room, and I'm killing people, it's Jason, and I'm like, <laughs> so I gotta grab a thing from me. So I'm like looking at the clock, and I'm like, it's nine thirty, it's getting, I gotta, I, I gotta get this shit. And I, I thought you guys, from what I got from the messages, with you guys were just sitting around and going, yeah. So, uh, did you see the? It wasn't even like not that, dude. We, we really was, we were kicking a good conversation, and all of a sudden, yeah. Jose's like, "Yeah, I guess we gotta wrap it up." Guy, I heard stop it. Yeah, <laughs> like, I was trying to take us off dude. at nine thirty on the dot because I know, like, I wasn't seeing your message messages in the in the messenger you know what i'm saying about going longer so i was like all right 9 30 we gotta wrap up Let's so you didn't up. see that <laughs> yeah i didn't see it yeah oh man I, next time i'll text you 
Yeah, because I was paying attention to the chat and everything like that. Yeah, so yeah, I, I yeah. There's a lot going on, of course. Yeah. So, yeah, I, so, so, I, like, I was like, though. so I was playing as a counselor. I'm the last one left. I'm done. <laughs> <laughs> and I swam across Crystal Lake. I'm hiding behind a rock. I got a minute and a half to go, and I keep fucking getting these texts. I'm like, fuck this. I got up out of the recliner. I came in over here. I put the headphones in. And I'm listening. These motherfuckers are talking like it's business as usual. <laughs> <laughs> talking like that, 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 that. I'm, like thinking, I heard. I'm thinking I'm gonna come in here and guys are gonna be like this. Uh, <laughs> yeah. uh, I don't know where it does that, but uh, he's supposed to stop the show. He's not here right now. All I was like, heard you. I was heard you. You said you were like, yeah. All right, hitting the, I'm hitting the button, guys, right now. All right, and I'm like, and oh, I was like, I was like you guys, like, what are you guys doing? Oh, I, I, I guess we're done. I guess we're done. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm like, and I nobody, nobody was answering me, and Jose was in. Jose was in outro mode. He's like, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> No. So I'm like, you I feel like they would just leave, you know, like like uh like it's happened where you just passed out and the show has gone on on air till four AM with you just like this. Yes. And nobody <laughs> else is there. So Nine, I mean, how many times was that? Three, four times? Yeah, we get yeah, it. We get yeah. it, Kenny. We explained why it happened. <laughs> 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 oh. <laughs> so so I'm doing this. I'm here with this. I'm trying to look over here. Hold on, I'm gonna turn my. I'm trying to look over here to see if Jason's gonna kill me because I found a really good spot. <laughs> I'm the last person alive is in like 45 seconds left, and I'm like, eh, eh. and Kose's like, I'm on a cool table. I was like, you know what? <laughs> Fuck this. We're done. Click. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> and I ran to the recliner, and motherfucking Jason found me in the last fucking 10 seconds of the game and killed me. <laughs> See, it is, it is. So I, I lost my yeah. 100 XP because you motherfuckers. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so yes, I see. That's not an aggravated. Is everything all right? Dave's like, oh, he's fine. He's like, he's just pissed off because he was playing game. And, yeah. and I was like, and I, said, I, I actually, I defended you. I said, you know what? I fucking hate that too, though. When I'm when I'm at balls deep into a Call of Duty or something like that, and I'm playing my ass off, and I'm about to get off the game for something, it fucking aggravates the shit out of me. <laughs> you know, you know, you know. It wasn't the fact, Russ. Here's what aggravates me. I'm hitting everybody up. Nobody's getting back to me. So I'm going by messages that I heard five, ten minutes ago. I got you. I you got know you. what I'm saying? So the communication yeah. wasn't there, and I'm just like, all right. Well, there was fuckers, man. Well, we'll have to make sure we improve on that. Maybe, maybe we all. Nah, all good, man. Don't mind it, on it, it don't I, I, You know what? The best part of it was I came and I was like. Fuck this. It's done. I'm hitting the button. Click. Yeah. <laughs> that was funny. That was great. I, 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 I say, hey, Dustin, can we finish the, uh, we finish yeah, the, the, uh, yeah. the outro? And you're yeah. like, nope, it's going by. Yeah, we, 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 <laughs> but we're about to do the outro. <laughs> Fuck the outro. Click. No, it was yeah. crazy. Yeah, when, you, yeah. when you came on, Dust, I was like literally like 30 seconds from finishing. Like, <laughs> I was just about to get well, to a shout out. So, you know? No, he, he came out and he's like, All right, good night, guys. No, I'm serious. Good night. All right, guys, good night. You're like, Good night, Dust. Good night, Dust. <laughs> no, 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 no. You don't get what I'm saying. I'm not going to bed. You're going to bed. <laughs> <laughs> It, I, think, I think it's one of the best endings to a show, though. Because I, re I, re I rewatched it. And I was, watching it, and I was fucking laughing, dude. It was, it was funny. It was funny. Honestly, man, I haven't had a chance to watch it tomorrow. I'll definitely, I'll definitely it's, throw it out. It's just a trip, dude. I was like, oh, yeah, this will be one I'm going to remember for a while. <laughs> <laughs> hey, why is Dave in the chat not on the panel? That's what I'm where the fuck you at, Dave? I don't know. I'm just saying. Mm hmm. Hmm. <laughs> Being shy tonight. Being shy. Being shy. <laughs> <laughs> right. It's just one second oh together. <laughs> Holy shit. Oh, man. If Dom was in here, he'd be in there and be like, you fucked up, man. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on. I got some kids, uh, getting in here. Uh, it's a super di dimensional wants a link. I'm going to shoot him a link. Oh. Get, get SD in here. Talk about his fans' toys. Uh, anybody else out there, man? Wants that link? Hit me up, man. I'm sorry. I, 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 and this is where I, I can't say anything because I wasn't checking my phone. <laughs> 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 I 
and I'm gonna pull a Jose. I got the chat. I got the show. I'm trying to. <laughs> yeah. No. <laughs> Poor Jose. He's like, dude, I got too much shit going on. Fuck you. <laughs> that was. I, I just honestly, man, it's fun stuff, man. It's it's it's, it's all about. It. A lot of people don't know. There's a lot of shit that goes in behind this. A lot of work that goes around this. There's a lot of communication. A lot of different people. A lot of different. You know, um, ideas, and it's that's what makes it so cool. Is because it's a commu- it's a community effort. Everybody coming together and making this work. It, it's funny that you say that, Dust, because I think you know before I kind of was able to start participating, I would message you and just be, "Hey, I appreciate what you guys do." Because from an outsider, it looks like a second job. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> and, you know what I mean. Uh, for um, some of us, it definitely is. Yeah, yeah. Can yeah. Be. Some, this is my first job. My second job. Eh. Yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs> but you know jose hosting you know when jamie does the plastic fanatics i'll message him and be like the research that guy does i think for his flashbacks is just out of this world oh, <laughs> yeah. you know, he's, he's the archive man he's unbelievable the yeah. work he puts into that yeah, and you know yes. it goes to show you like when you watch a plastic fanatics on saturday you got a show yep yep i'm yep. not kidding you when i'm when i whenever i'm i'm, I'm on a show i i I always feel like I'm just like the fucking, you know, the Ed Mc- I like you said, I'm the Ed McMahon. I'm the guy going, oh, 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 you know, because he's the one. He's got all this serious shit. He's real knowledge. The rest of us just around some banking it up. Yeah, but you know what? That's the whole point. And like when he says, "Hey, join me in the fanatics. We're the fanatics. We're the crew. You know yeah. what I mean? We pop in, and you know, yeah, yeah, man, it's it's us. It, it's just." We're just have a good time. We play off each other and just laugh and, you know, make some stupid jokes, make people laugh in the chat, make people laugh that watch the show. And that's what it's about. It's, it's, a, it's a form of entertainment, you know? Yeah, right. Exactly. But it, that, that's, that's all I try to do is just be a little comedy relief sometimes. <laughs> yeah, man. Just, you know. I wouldn't know anything about that. Uh, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the problem with me is three quarters of my jokes don't land. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you, need, you need Brian Brink. Superpower, yeah, yeah, you know? it was a superpower. What the fuck is Brian Brink tonight, man? <laughs> He's got that big ass pile of loot. You see what he got this week? Yeah. Yeah. Oh my god! Jesus Christ, man! Enter the realm maybe like forty-five five. minutes longer, not because of the TFCon co- coverage, of course not. <laughs> but because of Brian home. Brink's fucking haul that he got. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, man. I don't know if you guys saw uh, Dave's. Comment on his his post of the photo. He's like, if if that had been in New York, that shit would be gone. <laughs> oh hell yeah, why you, dude! Why do you think I have a post office box? I can't leave yeah, shit like yeah. that on my doorstep. No, no not here. Same here. No, my town either. Gone. Not possible. Gone. Yeah. Well, motherfuckers will just walk up, see a box, and just grab it. The one that lets in the box will just grab that shit. <laughs> That's fucking crazy. What's in the fucking box? I don't care. I'm, I'm taking it anyway. Yeah. Right. I'm just stealing this shit. You know. Yeah. I want to do like, like I want to do like an experiment. Like put a GoPro somewhere outside my door and shit in a fucking box. <laughs> put a note right on the shit. Oh. Enjoy it, bitch. <laughs> 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 oh, <laughs> I'm gonna tell you right now, I know it. I know it's these cocksuckers upstairs. These white trash, seventeen kids in a one-bedroom apartment having motherfuckers upstairs. I know it. I know it's them. You know, here's the thing: three adults up there, like six kids, all driving brand new cars. You can't get yeah. a two-bedroom apartment for that's your fucking kids. Uh, that's ridiculous. You're a piece yeah. of shit. Don't even yeah. come to me. I'm not even talking about it because I'll get upset. <laughs> I'm, I'm left. Left right now. I gotta drink a beer. Oh man! <laughs> that was funny. Funny. All right, Leave beers and Leave bullshit. We definitely the, box. the bullshit. <laughs> yeah, man. My, my friend, my, my friend Mikey, man. He was like his parents were like that. They lived in this shithole house, man. But they always had these really nice cars. And like his dad drove a Porsche, but he lived in a shithole. Oh, yeah, it. I, I thought I sent it to Brent. Who the fuck did I send the fucking link to? I don't know. Hey, but Russ, what you said? We have those guys all the time. <laughs> Brink. I'm sorry, bro. <laughs> you send them? You send Shut up them the fucking tonight? Facebook. Way too many Brian's. Way too many Brian's in my city. Yeah, for sure. But we got this all the time here in, in my town. We have all those guys driving, I don't know, like V8s, V10s all the time. And I swear, 100%. Their fridge is empty. Their fucking house is empty. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> hey, for real. Bare bones. 
<laughs> Yo, man, you know, I got to tell you, I mean, I've, I know I have had some discussions about my upstairs neighbors before on the show, but, you know, I've seen the fucking the mom of these white trash kids. I mean, they got to be in their like, mid to late 20s. She went to yep. pick the kids up at the fucking bus stop <laughs> with a beer can and a koozie. <laughs> oh man, yo, that's some red that shit. They, I, that's some shit I see down here, dude. You should, they dude, must yo, be for real, this bitch look like the sea hag. It's incredible. Yeah, you know, man, the size of my fucking index finger. You know what I mean? Like she oh, has that yeah. alcoholic straw for hair scarecrow look. Yeah, you know yeah, that's what you mean. like the strung out looks, like uh -huh. like yeah. with, the, with the bottom chin that's coming forward because it's it's all fucked up in there, you know. Yeah. Yeah, put on, <laughs> put too many things in your mouth. <laughs> hey, 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 Dust, hey, Dust, what's your address again? What's up? <laughs> <laughs> uh, P.O. Box. <laughs> Post office box. Hey, it's funny. It's like when I was with my ex, they used to she used to get like you know how like um. Like you got what the fuck is that? What the, what the fucking loot crate shit? Well, they yeah. gotta have it for like makeup and stuff like that, and they would drop it at the front door, and that shit would just disappear. Yeah. Everybody else's boxes, but the ones that's because our doors are like this. So I'm gonna highlight my camera. You know, my front door. My front door's here. Their front door's like there. So there's kind of like a like a little index. You know, there's four apartments. One, 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 and me. I got you. You know, yeah. so it's. Because it's closer to their, they're the ones that are fucking taken, without a doubt, man, without a doubt. So like, like, I didn't fall into that trap, man. I just got a post office box, done. Like I said, I want to yeah, put a GoPro up there, shit in a box, and say, "Yo, got you." That'd be funny. <laughs> that would actually would be funny. I'd fucking laugh my ass off. There's no any shit in the box. <laughs> See, don't, you know what? Don't get me wrong. I don't live in. I don't live in a bad fucking development. Oh, um, God. It's working class people. There's tons of different types of ethnic groups. I mean, I lived in the projects in Brooklyn back in the day. I know how it is with sure. people. You know, uh, people right. of race to say I would be be. You know, right. <clears throat> you have everybody here. It's a smelting pot. It's not bad. It's quiet at night. There's trees. It reminds me of the project. <laughs> but, but, um, <laughs> You know, there's no beat up cars, nice cars. Everybody respects each other and all that bullshit. But this shit, when you put fucking three fucking kids in a one bedroom with fucking three adults, and they just had a newborn, mm. come on, man, do something yeah. about it. And you're all you're driving new cars and shit, man. Yeah, I don't like, know. Just, I don't want to <clears throat> get on that level here, man. But. All motherfuckers are breathing. That's all I'm saying. Sea hags are breeding. Creating mm. more sea hags. Little sea hags. I feel like everybody's like, you know, like, why are you moving? Well, that's one of the bigger reasons why I'm fucking moving. Yeah. Huh? Exactly. Hey, fuck I'm, it, I'm staying in this development because I really like it here. It's a really nice place. I just got to get the fuck out of where I am. I got you. You want to move just to a different apartment? The unit yeah, yeah, yeah. I got yeah. Same thing. It's going to be the, probably most likely the same layout and shit. Like, you couldn't even tell because I'll probably have it the same way it looks here. Yeah. <laughs> like, like, <laughs> that's going to be like, <laughs> Dust, did you fucking move? No. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it's all just an illusion. That's it. Yeah, man. There's a backdrop. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> 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 you know, just, that's true those aren't real figures on those shelves yeah uh, it's, it's, a, it's a green screen it's a matte painting that's yo funny, super dude. dimensional what's up bro Ryan, hey what's up big man how you doing huh? what's up brian what's up man i'm not working saw you guys were doing this so i figured i'd drop in and say what up what's yeah. going on man what's new man what's happening i don't know what are you guys talking about Everything, man. Life. The fact that Dust challenge. doesn't actually have figures and it's just a green screen. Yeah. 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 <laughs> <behind the screen. laughs> old, old people are assholes and people yeah, have a car. My team. neighbors suck. Yeah. <laughs> uh, moving back home. Fuck that bitch. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Jose sipping on some brand juice. You know, just, you know, everything but what Grand, we normally talk about. Us. What is it, Grandma's apple juice? Grandma's peach tree. Yeah, was it peach Grandma's tea? peach uh, peach tea. Pea. Is that, is that you peach. Stepping on the peach tea. 
Ice tea. tea. Yum, yum. All right. I like peach mm. tea. It's pretty good. Uh, <laughs> not not CBS, you know. Granny's peach tea. I mean, that's what I'm saying. You got it. You got now it. Now you finally got it. Hey, I mean, drink, you got it. You got and it. And he's, and he's drinking out of a Superman cup to boot. <laughs> and you finally got it. Hey, hey, I'm drinking. I know. It takes that's the whole point. Longer. I mean, that, that peach tea is carrying a lot of food. You got hey, it. Hey, Jose, you in a different room tonight? No, I'm just at a different angle. It's a funny angle. Yeah, construct us to the right. Yeah, I see like Devastator on yeah. your <laughs> fucking <laughs> shoulder. Yeah, you see, you see, right. Oh, yeah, you, usually you're that way. You, yeah. You, yeah. Yeah. And there's no WWF playing in the background. That's good. <laughs> <laughs> Trying to keep the noise to a minimum, you know? <laughs> All right, man. It's, it's, oh, it's, it's wow. been an hour, and we're pretty much wrapping up intros and whatnot. That's pretty good. <laughs> hey. <laughs> Hey, shout, out to, uh, shout out to the, uh, the these nuts, super these nuts, no robot talk. Yeah, well, watch this for about a half hour. Be like, fuck this thing you talk about Transformers. <laughs> 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 yeah, tonight's just, just a chill back, man. Just kick back and relax, type shit, man. I'm sure oh, we also we all saw that TFCon nonsense. Uh, we'll, well, we'll talk about that at a later date. Dude. I didn't see too much of it, to be honest. Oh, well, there wasn't much to see. Yeah. We're going to have so much material to talk about over the next yeah. week or two. No, we it's won't. Because yeah. real... it's the same shit we've been seeing. Man, that's yeah. a good point. But actually, that's there was, there was some stuff. stuff. There was some there stuff. stuff. There was some stuff. Really there was no fan stories of Omega Supreme. Like, hey, uh, we're not talking yeah. about it now. Yeah. <laughs> well, that's not what it is. There's no big drop. So, that. Kenny, tell us about your upstairs neighbors. <laughs> <laughs> That's awesome, dude. So, so Kenny, where where you where did you say you moving back to? Uh, Rhode Island. I'm Rhode Island. Island? Oh, cool. Okay. Middle East of Providence. Oh, nice. The Middle East. No, a little east. Uh, hopefully, oh, I'll live around there. Providence, Kenny, like Pawtucket. I'm looking at a place in Pawtucket as soon as I get there. Like Rhode Island's so small, like everything's little up there, right? Like, <laughs> like, <fucking laughs> so is Kenny. God, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. That's right in. That's wild, dude. Damn. Oh, good for you, man. It's just it'd be good if you you'd be all right to be back on the East Coast. That's awesome. You know? Back home, I, I can't wait. I can't wait. So yeah, can sure. about seven hours away from me. Yeah, I'm I sure can we'll see, I'm the sure drive we'll down a couple times every weekend. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Are you kidding me? He's a seven-hour drive from you, Dust. Well, it's four hours. Well, it's four let's see. To New York, yeah. roughly. Is he really? God damn, dude! Shout out to Google shit. Maps. We're gonna bring up the Google yeah, Maps. Yeah, I guess I just, I guess I, I just, um, um, you know, I was terrible. At, Kenny, you know, what was it? Yeah, uh, ju just go to Providence. That'll be it. Providence. Hey, and now for a little fun fact. Hey, if you want a little fun fact from a German, if I ride seven hours from my location, I'm almost all out of Germany. Nice. Shout out to See, Austria. Me. God damn, that's. That's what I mean. It sounds so crazy to me. If I travel seven hours, dude, I could be down a fucking. Uh, Georgia. <laughs> God damn, I'm in Virginia. You know, my hats. I'm like uh, waiting on the fucking coast. That's crazy. Wookie, relax. It's, it's just uh, Provi it's Providence Place, Providence, Rhode Island. Rhode Island. Yeah, That's what yeah, it's coming yeah. up with. That's fine. Wow, you got a PF Changs out there, man. <laughs> Cheesecake Factory, the Melting Pot, man. You got a lot of places. Fuck Providence Applebee's. Place, man. It's a great place. Fuck Good Applebee's. Oh, oh, it's about three hours and forty-five minutes. Not bad. Okay, not that's not. Good. That's a little bit better. Okay. okay. Yeah, that's not yeah. eightful. I yeah, thought. I, thought that, I honestly, before you said seven hours, I thought it was going to be like five or six. So. No, it's, it's, it's a lot better. A little over three hours, man. Yeah, it shouldn't be too bad. Shout out to sleeping on the inflatable mattress. Hell yeah, man. <laughs> Doing it live right here. Well, if you make it, to, if you make it to TFCon, it'll take you probably about six hours to get down here. I don't know, six yeah. hours maybe. Yeah, me and Bricks were already talking about that. Hey, about, uh, arrangements. And that's 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 what you need to do. Is kind of how when you did the two guys from Jersey, you just start inviting people to your place and put one on the couch. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we were actually supposed to do one tonight, but it didn't happen, so we just got to get a replacement in here. <laughs> exactly. That's awesome. <laughs> So I was like, I'll make sure your fucking ass makes the show. <laughs> so, <laughs> it, it's going to come down to one guy from Jersey. It's just going to be me sitting like this going. Do, 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 do. 
Do, 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 do. Yes, I love to watch this. I'm watching one guy from Jersey. Look, all they do is drink beer. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> time. We're about two hours in. Do, 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 do. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Oh, he's awesome, dude. Holy <laughs> shit. <laughs> <laughs> Man, you know, two years with this shit, man. We've been having a good time. A lot of good stuff, man. A lot of good people coming in and out. And oh, my life has definitely gotten much better since I got to know you guys. That's for <laughs> damn sure. Man, Russell, I remember like it was like Holy a TFCon, Charlotte. Yeah, TFCon, that's where, that's the first time I met you guys in person. Before then, I just, uh, fifteen, right? Yeah, I guess I'd been coming. I'd been coming on the hangouts for a couple months before then. Just kind of, mm -hmm. and then uh, yeah, well, we, we weren't that. broadcasted back then. Yeah, that's what I'm broadcasting. Yep. Yeah, well, I don't think we were broadcasting back then. We didn't no. start broadcasting until about a year ago. So Yeah. No, longer than a year. Was a, little, oh, a little bit longer than a year. It's been like three years since there's been broadcasting. No, no, no. Well, we weren't broadcasting yeah. Hangouts three years ago. Hangouts? Right? Yeah. We no, weren't we, we've, we've been doing Hangouts. Now. We've been doing Hangouts for three years. We've been years doing of Hangouts for like for three years, but not broadcasting on the yeah. YouTube channel. Broadcasting for two. About two. ETR for two, broadcasting, maybe hangouts. The hangouts yeah. were going for a few months at least before ETR. Yeah, but we weren't broadcasting. No, no, no. Yeah, no, no, but not Kenny, 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 are you listening? No, 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 no. I know that the un unbroadcasting were going on. Mm -hmm. I, I was part of those. Yeah, yeah that's that's <laughs> when I first got into the, the guys mm -hmm. I was, when I first started jumping in was on, on unbroadcasted hangouts. Yeah, we're doing like five yeah. or six a week. Oh, yeah. I never yeah, got a I check. I was on about half of them a week. <laughs> Wait for that check. I've been waiting for that check for years. Residuals. <laughs> What's that? The residuals? Yeah, where's, where's my residuals? Where's my residuals? I'm going to get that like fucking six months from now. Yeah, you know, yeah. I was on six episodes. I never got any fucking check for that <laughs> You got a check for like 15 cents. Fuck right? you, Deluxe. You ain't getting that <laughs> shit. I understood that, that I was getting paid for my time. <laughs> nah, we just got the, the trick is we have to find a con something controversial and do a special on it. Yeah. Everybody fucking in the world wants to watch it. That's what you got to do. You, do you remember? All right. Do you guys remember when they announced that Megatron car? Uh, and we did that you? one episode where we yep. talked about the pictures and said what we wanted to say. Yep. That fucking I, I I haven't checked since we got like nine thousand views on that one yes. video. Yes, so that's like, because I remember it was the week before TFCon because I was going to buy a third party Megatron at TFCon, but then they announced it. It was like it was, yeah, it was the week of. It was all about the the thumbnail and what we named it. Everybody must have thought that it was like we had it in hand, and they I think so. They, but yet they watched it the whole video anyway. Yeah. Yeah. And uh, you know what we generated? I think it was like six bucks. <laughs> <laughs> <I don't Wait. laughs> God, YouTube really pays off, doesn't it? Yeah, I'm telling you, <laughs> the YouTube game is tough. We've been at yeah, this God, two years, dude. and our YouTube channel just recently, you only get paid by the $100 from AdSense. Oh, wow. You only get paid per $100. Two years at this. So many episodes from ETR, all the what's in the fucking boxes, everything. We just generated our first hundred dollars. You know where that went to? <laughs> and you know where that went to? The website fees. Uh, yeah, I'm about to say, <laughs> got you have, yeah, she got other other overhead. Great, dude. Yeah, yeah oh, it's not going God. into anybody's pocket. It's going yeah. back into the kitty. It's like woohoo, profit. And uh, that's the thing. That's the thing, right? It's not. It's not about money. It's, no, it's a community. Yeah, yeah, yeah a community. I mean, sure. Tim. I'm even. I'm. I'm even. I'm. I'm German. You know, I'm as far in the distance as I can get. But exactly what Russ said. The last few months, I'm in this. I'm in all of this. You know, and it's been like I don't know. It's it's the best time to lose sleep. Really? <laughs> 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 it's just. I mean, it's even, I can't sleep, I know there's a hangout, I get up, I don't even try to sleep anymore. I get up and I pop in and have a good time with you guys, instead of rolling around in the sheets, getting shit. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you're fucking committed, dude, or should it, be. Yeah. Well, you That's know, a lot of people, especially a lot of people that first got into this, they said it's very intoxicating because, you know, they're finding people that enjoy what they like and what they want to do. 
Exactly. And there's nobody around them. And, yeah. you know, we created yeah. a venue that we could bring people together. Yeah. Hey, we're not in the same room, but come on. Honestly, I can't touch it, but this is pretty much the same fucking room. Yeah, you know exactly. I mean? exactly. We're not the fucking interwebs, you know. We're not sitting there going, LOL, you know, insert <laughs> joke here. You know, we're not, we're not typing like back in the day. This is like, this is like yeah. the next level fucking um, chat room. You know what yeah. I mean? This is the next room ch AOL instant messenger chat room, you know. And, yeah. Uh, I mean that that's it. That that's why I get that the chat is not going up so well. I mean, it's like talking directly one on one is exactly. always a different. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. That's it. So shout out to the chat squad. But you know, that's why this venue chat. it just works so well and Absolutely. everybody that, that that is a part of this is like, wow, this is amazing how we could just do this. I thought I was alone. There's more people like you that were so so similar and mm -hmm. you know. That's, that's exactly what makes it. this work so well. And I'm yeah. going to get off the soapbox. Even with like all of our different time zones and work schedules and this and that, it's, uh, you know, just having the, the stuff on YouTube where you can kind of catch up and watch things later and, you know, see what exactly. everybody's up to. It's kind of cool. I'm sorry, dude. I just looked at the tagline. <laughs> <laughs> you know, check out Bright's TF Convince Dustin. <laughs> <laughs> What's going on with that? What, like, I didn't hear about anything like that. You know, I, I, I saw what was the third party panel, and there's like nothing really new, nothing that I'm interested in. I'm like, I'm fucking done. I can't wait to be done with this hobby. I was so excited today to see things that were going to make me say, I can't wait to spend my money on it and fuck yeah. everybody. <laughs> yeah. It was and just Brian was in the in Instagram. I wonder, I wonder well, okay, so without talking about the actual uh, reveals or anything, what do you think is bigger now? Toronto or the whatever the US location is? See, they used to drop everything in Toronto and then we yeah. need to get the scraps. Yeah, right. Mm -hmm. But much. I think last year Fans Toys dropped the bomb. Yeah, they did. In Chicago. So I think Fans yeah. Toys being they really didn't drop anything this year, they're gonna drop the bomb. We're gonna I see more bomb. Right. Yeah. And you know, like I know we're not discussing it, but I think what, what the fan what the end the end point of that third party panel was gonna be X T V Stunticons. But yet they had to release the pictures early because of the thieving. Yeah. yeah. Uh, really. So, so there was the grand finale. Anyway. You get what I'm saying? So yeah. Those were new. The other three were new in the combined form. Huh? Yeah. I thought yeah. we already yeah. saw those. those we only so, saw hey, two. Well, welcome we to the only... ROC Hangout TFCon edition. What the fuck? They're like, you know what? We're gonna get, we're gonna get dust drunk and talk TFCon. <laughs> <laughs> hey, okay, but but for real about that thing, um, Dust, you said maybe you would be out. Actually, I have the fear with San Diego Comic Con that sh that shit will put me back in with Pop Toys. Because now they uh, released a panel of Avengers Infinity War mm -hmm. with uh, the first teaser, which looked pretty big. They showed panels with this Infinity Gauntlet and the, uh, the Stark Order, and we haven't even seen Hot Toys prototypes. And normally on San Diego Comic Con, Hot Toys drops the fucking bomb collectible terms. Mm -hmm. uh, that wasn't Thanos with the Infinity Gauntlet. That was me with a roll of toilet paper. <laughs> <laughs> Shout out to Dust for that plot twist. Just put it out there. <laughs> it's, a twist. it's a twist. It's a twist. <laughs> I, I, I tell you what, though, Kenny, when I, when I first, the first TFCon I went to was the one down in Charlotte, and I was I couldn't believe how big the show was. I was shocked. And how huge it was, and then the um, and then last year it seemed like it seemed like every year in America, the United States one is getting bigger and bigger, and and I think it's getting more and more important. Now I'm curious, uh, what what had you been to before the Charlotte show? Oh, I would just go to local cons, you know, TFCon, not TFCon, but like normal Comic Cons and shit like that. I never, I mean, I've never been to BotCon because you know, fuck Hasbro. Yeah. Um, <laughs> down the block. Yeah, the first con I went to was TFCon Chicago. Now three okay. years, three years passed, and then I went to last year's, and right. it was a lot bigger last year than it was. Yeah. Last year. See, so that, I could see how Charlotte would have been bigger too. Yeah, that was my concern. Was I heard like the first one in Chicago sucked because they had it in the basement, 
that it, it wasn't was big. I mean, if you guys remember Charlotte, Charlotte was big, open. You had those big grand ballrooms. Yeah. And all that in terms room. of how many vendors there were, it was oh, probably the same, maybe just a little bit less. But mm. the space, like you could actually move around. Yeah, and if you, you can move around. Through, yeah. If you were digging through those bins, it wasn't like you were getting stepped on. The, you know, so, so this one. Yeah, that area was bigger, and they had things broken up, so they had a lot of rooms. So where the uh, where all the the artists were, that where, where they were off to like the right hand side, and then you had all the guests off to the right hand side. They had their own rooms, so it was like, okay, if you want to go see the guests, you go over here. If you want to go see the artists, you go over here. Mm. So instead of being the, the 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 one room, I might be thinking about Con at the same time though too. I think I'm they probably not. together. Shout out, shout out to Yingling drafts. <laughs> <laughs> and and then mixing with Coors Light, you know? yeah, mixing yeah, yeah. that Coors Light, and fuck it, it's over. Yeah. Oh, it's in the can too. I, I'm in the can. No, I, for some reason Coors Light in the can. I it's it's it's, it's <laughs> prime time with Kenny Prime is turning into uh, uh, Kenny getting it in the can. I don't know. <laughs> oh, 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 Kenny in the can. Oh, it's, Kenny, it's, it's, uh, it's Kenny on a budget. All right, Kenny doesn't have a job, so he had to buy our YouTube is going to go from $100 from two years to $100 in a month. Yeah. Oh, yeah. For sure. <laughs> tagging line, tag line that. Hey, hey, hey. I'm going to have a GoFundMe. Buy me better beer. <laughs> Buy me better beer. <laughs> <laughs> well, you know that was you know, like like they they said that like everybody was like yeah the Chicago show it was you know well, I was so worried about that again when we yeah. went back to Chicago that it was gonna be like that and the Chicago I think the Chicago show was nice it wasn't you didn't have the ambiance that you did from the Charlotte show yeah Charlotte I thought well the bar was much the better bar, in Charlotte. the bar was huge you had the outside you had the fire pit yeah the bar was extremely small Not, well here we are complaining about bars. Yeah, of course. <laughs> I'm not complaining hey, about the course. venue like, like, or got to go bar, but well, I mean, know, or, or the spread out area room or anything like that. We're complaining about the yeah. bar. Just let it, letting <laughs> you know what's really important. You know? yeah. Right, exactly. Yeah. 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 We're not there to see panels and fucking yeah. paint the figure. <laughs> you know, we're there to kick it and chill, <laughs> man. Shout out to Iron Claw. Gotta have priorities. Yep. Yep. DFCon is all about socializing. He he won That's back in not... Chicago and he won at Toronto. He he won the Masterpiece Megatron. What's that? Yeah. At Iron Claw. He won the two years ago he won the well last October he won the, the video game uh, uh contest. Yes. That's right. Yeah, yeah. they got that fucking I remember, yeah. They could have the the or, or, or Thundercracker, the titanium one. Yeah, you got that the shit figure, I remember. Shout out to him, man. That's kick ass, dude. I'm glad to see uh one again. It'll probably come see me at GFCon this year in America win again too. <laughs> I'd love for him to uh to, to come down. He's my roommate in Chicago. He was a good dude. <laughs> yeah, man. Hell yeah. So it's like you know, like the first GFCon that we went to, you know. Um, the, the, most of the ETR crew was there, you know, some ROC members. We were still growing. We were still going, you know, we're trying to grow up and, and get into the game and do what we can. Um, and, but the second show was just like, phenom like when everybody was there. And you, oh, you know, my God. I told you. Know, you last the people and it just like October it, it, was to show how, so how much so. we grow. We have grown in a year yeah. was incredible. And Bobby, Bobby was saying every fucking where he looked, there was a there was an inner, there was a fucking uh, ROC shirt. What the fuck? <laughs> I was laughing. Well, you know what? The first year we went down, we tried to make an impact, and we had the, the beads with the Enter the Realm and the ROC yeah. cards connected to them. Yeah. And like, I just, I, I just recently went through Instagram and I found a pic of Dan. Like, he had all the beads on his arms, but he, we didn't realize that they would get tangled. And they got tangled really bad. <laughs> so we just couldn't just hand them out to people and mm. throw them around there. Fucking, you know, so. Um, but yet for that year, you watch any video, you, you look at any uh, pictures, you look at anything from that. All you see is people wearing beads with the ROC cards <laughs> on them. They're in elevators. They're everywhere. You know? <laughs> you know I, was, what I'm so, I kept finding them in the bathroom and shit. I was laughing. Yeah. I was like, so the first shit. year we made such a big impact with that. And, you know, I think if we would have rolled that program out now, we would be more comfortable talking to people. But, you know, the first time there, we, you know, we didn't know many sure. people. We yeah. just didn't, you know, we didn't have the swag we have now. And nowadays, I'm, yo, 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 yo. 
Hold this. Hold this. You're taking it. You're taking it. Put this on. Put that on. You know. Well, now you got a lot of people coming up to you guys and shit, too. I mean, I mean, it's not it's really, so, man. We're not like that, so. man. No, oh, man, I don't know. Oh, I'm thinking, what was the what was the kid's name? Uh, like, Cadmus, man. Cadmus, Cadmus, Cadmus right? Made my, it was Cadmus. Cadmus <laughs> made TFCon for me last yeah, year, man. It was Cadmus? That's right. Oh man, it was so cool, man. To meet that dude, and you know how excited he was, and like, you know he was a fan of us, Shattercast, everybody that's in, you know the whole fandom and whatnot, but walking him around, showing him, t- introducing him to people and, you know, him taking pictures and whatnot, you know, and I guess that's why we, we let him on the broadcast and chew. Yeah, it was, it was <laughs> so funny because was, was, after, after the con, we had the big, you know, hang out and he came on on broadcast and shit and I said, I said, I said yeah, I, said, I didn't see you, man, but I didn't mention you. He goes, who are you? <laughs> said, <"Fuck> you. <laughs> <laughs> I said, Gee. Okay, some of us doesn't know. Fucking some of us kiss my ass. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah, but the socializing with everybody is definitely the best thing about going to these conventions because we could do what we did today. We could sit back, get on social media, get all the news and from right. the panels and everything, all the pictures, <laughs> without having to spend a thousand dollars or whatever you spend going to these conventions. It's you. You spend the money because you want to hang out. You want to see the yeah. town, and that's yeah. the best thing about yeah. it. Yep. Let's, right. you know I mean, DC I gotta, is gonna oh, hold, hold on. I gotta take a piss real quick, but let's let's talk TFCon. Let's yeah. talk about the experience and the social experience. You know, we all know what's gonna be there, toys and whatnot. Let's talk about what we are, what the ROC means to TFCon. Uh, we know? are. The How, how's that feel? I gotta take a piss. How about that? Cool. Yeah. <laughs> How about that? How about we're changing the fucking name of it to fucking ROC Con? How about yeah, that? Right. <laughs> hey, 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 hey. hey, Russ. <laughs> Russ, yeah, give us two, up? three years. ROC right. Con. Oh, there you go. Happen, We're man. working on it, brother. <laughs> it's gonna happen. Yeah, that well, is well. definitely gonna work. <laughs> yeah, it's it's funny. So that's I mean that's the main thing. This is gonna be my first TF Con in DC this year, and that's the obviously the main thing I'm looking forward to is just hanging out with people. Yeah, and uh, you know having fun exactly. with that part of it. That's that's especially also my thing. I mean, I have in this few months, I have been pretty close with Dave over the messenger. He's like, I don't know, that guy, it totally clicked. I mean, it clicked with everybody, but with this dude especially. And he actually, he actually tried to convince me to come to TFCon this year. Wow. <laughs> well, Tim, <laughs> come on, man. Get your passport. Hop on that, hop on that $2,000 fucking flight. Let's go. <laughs> exactly. That's the problem. That's that dude. Ooh, I, can't, sure. I, I cannot rip it, but I... I have this in the plans next year, so uh, that's cool. That will be oh, that's yeah. awesome. That's great, man. That's that's awesome, Tim. Yeah. That would be really dope. I mean, see you guys in person. That would be a total mind fuck. I swear. Now, now, Tim, <laughs> let me ask you: Are you on Instagram? Because that's the only thing I use anyway. Uh, yeah, I am. Well, uh, what's your name on there? It is there at Figure Photography Crate. Figure yeah. Photography Crate. Crate like Loop Crate. Crate. Yeah. Exactly. Okay. <laughs> See if I can spell. I yeah, can't. Yeah. We're trying to get <laughs> trying to get fucking that's, Kenny Prime to you know use other. Yeah, right. Yeah, so that's that's, uh, that's just so cool. Like exactly what Gary said. Like, or, or Jose also the, the the community with everybody. That this it's just so cool. That's that's our Yeah. Like what dude. I have. What I come to know, it's perfect. It's awesome. Yeah, dude, that's that's what it's all about. That's what the experience is really about. You know, because yeah. like I said, like you, we're online, we're on social media. You could get all the news. Like the thing with going to NJCC, people driving two and a half hours, three hours. Russ, you came up the last time. You know, you drove yeah. four hours. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like that says something. You know what I'm saying? You're not gonna drive four hours to go to a shitty little bullshit toy show. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. You're going for the people. You know, and um, yeah. I mean, so I. And I remember you guys talking about the, uh, I, I mentioned this on one of the other shows, on the March, I think, NJCC, and uh, you guys were kind of talking like, hey, if you, you know, if you have to drive more than 90 minutes, it probably might not be worth it. And uh, I actually I remember I was snow throwing my, my driveway. <laughs> and, uh, you know, listening to the podcast, I was like, oh, I should have gone. Yeah, I missed that one. And uh, when I did that toy show with the guys, I'm like, oh, that's, that was phenomenal. Was such a good time. So I'm yeah, looking yeah. at NJCC, like I'm looking, you know, at the next toy show <laughs> in New Jersey, well, yeah. you know, in November. You, Gary, NJCC, I think, is growing as well. I think mean, yeah. that that's a, that, I mean, that convention, Jose, aren't they doing it to two, now it's going to be two days now, right? Yeah, it's a two-day oh, thing now. The next one on uh, August 12th and 13th, right. that weekend, yeah. Saturday and Sunday, right? Yep, yep, yep. 
Yeah, I can, so, I, mean, I can also actually wait for the for the German con we have. It's, it's called Cons. It is also Hasbro, yeah, sponsored. Yeah, let's call it Hasbro sponsored, and that will be pretty cool too. I will do little coverage for all you guys. So actually, only looking at Transformers, that will be something. In Germany, support is bad. I'm oh, sorry, Tim. Did you say it's called Cunt? Because <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's, that's what I said. That's what I said. The smile so much for saying it clear. No, it's, it's I was called. Like, please please tell me that's some kind yeah. of like, uh, anagram or something. I, <laughs> I, I, I can see what's on your mind, Russ. Right. Uh, no, <laughs> <I'm sorry. laughs> hey, listen. Listen, listen. Sh- shout out to Russ for saying what we were all thinking. You see, they <laughs> think you can't it out loud. <laughs> Unfortunately, it gets me into a lot of trouble. But anyway. <laughs> I thought it said cons. Like, they put all the cons into one. Yeah, exactly. It's I like, like break you. It is, it is called cons. Cybertron's yeah. open new uh-huh. spaceport. <laughs> okay, okay. I feel better. I... I, was, yeah. I, I swear I thought you said kind. I'm sorry. I was like, I just wanted to make sure we had it. I had to I had to I had to realize it on my screen because of his reaction. Someone said the C word. <laughs> <laughs> it's, like, it's like all over the web. It's a German Transformers convention yeah, call. It's definitely all over the web. <laughs> 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 Uncle Dust goes to the bathroom and look what he comes back to. Yeah, <laughs> I can't leave you guys alone for fucking three minutes. Hey, I, I, I said that thing. I said that thing. Horse porn and cock. <laughs> oh my god, dude. <laughs> okay, I'm out. Now, now uh, I, I have another question. Uh, Gary, are you on Instagram? Uh, yeah, I'm not real active on Instagram, uh, but funny enough, uh, Kenny, actually, I actually you know, just messaged you on Facebook, so oh, okay. uh, I might be able to help you out when you get back to Rhode Island. Oh, work. Ooh, yep. ooh, ooh, nice. Yes. Yes. Job, nice. Job Making wise. the connection. Oh, oh, see, yep. it's, it, oh. it's, and see, it's not what you know, it's who you know. Yep. Yeah. That's never what we know. do here at ROC. We exactly. collect. <laughs> hey, hey, here in the ROC, we and collect connect. and connect. connect. Yep. Yeah. Exactly. Hey, that's actually pretty fucking good, Dust. Damn. <laughs> that was a hashtag I tried a couple years ago, and it didn't work. Dust, yeah, I, do have, I do have a, uh, a legitimate business question and i know uh, eric was asking about this too but are the okay. uh, the new shirts and the uh, roc packs going to be out before dc you think uh, we, we we are working on that right now and more news will come in the pa- in the future okay that's all right. I no i did you know he, he, is he in the chat asking again no no we were talking earlier today but yeah man yeah. Didn't, we, didn't, didn't i talk to you guys when we were in fucking applebee's i was like uh, buffalo wild wings were at fucking uh, toy con Relax, it's coming. It's yeah, coming. well, I re- I remember even in the thread um, when he posted it in the group, um, everybody was like, "Well, you know, the shirts came out at TFCon last year, you so know, you why know." Would, why wouldn't we? <laughs> if we dropped this bomb on TFCon last year. Why wouldn't we drop another bomb on TFCon again? But, but listen, when when the crew <laughs> is that excited, they're gonna start bootlegging their own stuff. <laughs> Make a KO ROC T-shirt. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, you know who KO the ROC T-shirt? Fucking Energon addict. Energon addict. I was going to do that as a joke. But... <laughs> he fucking legitimately KO'd a fucking ROC shirt. He's like, I never got in this one, so I made my own. <laughs> that shit was iron on with wrinkles and it. it, was, it, was, it, was, it, was, it was, he made an iron on from the internet. But you know what? Yo, shout out to Dave. I love that dude to death, dude, man. That's yeah, my man. Dude, awesome. dude, that guy brought me a uh, ROC bag to the New Jersey Toy Show so I would fit in, you know? And I was like, I, I need a shirt. <laughs> I'm like, I need to represent. all about that, man. We don't want people to feel like they got to burn merchandise to be part of the ROC, man. You're part of the ROC. Yeah, not Once you about. get in here and yep, you chill. Yeah, here. But, yep, hey, you know what? It's here. always good to support the team. Hey. Yeah, I and then, you know what? I, and here I go again on my thing. None of the fucking money that we make, mm-hmm. any of this shit, goes into any pockets. It goes back into nope. a pool that mm-hmm. goes back into yeah. doing things for us and the group. Pays for the websites, pays for the tables at the shows, it pays for the next projects, pays for the fucking hats and the glasses and all that bullshit and any yeah, stupid cool. ideas that we may come up with. Like, hey, let's make ROC toilet seats. Yeah, man. <laughs> <laughs> awesome. I love it. Hey, ROC crotch box. So coming soon. Wait, wait, coming soon. Box <laughs> so, so Gary, you do you do have a uh, Rama Collector shirt now, right? 
I do not. That's why I was asking the question. Oh, I do okay. Not. Yep. Yes, I need more too. Yeah, exactly. For, yeah, for a TFCon, we're definitely gonna have to get you swagged up because we gotta absolutely. represent TFCon. All right. No, so absolutely. Absolutely. <laughs> and look, it's it's not about merchandise, but look, it's about fun and it's about pride, you know, and feeling good for what that's you know what what it's about, you know. You know, you yeah. know, you know where we were before. And now we we've come so far. Back when we first started the merchandise, it was a pre-order, and we used to do T-shirts. Um, anybody what? that wanted it, they pre-ordered it. And yep. we, we got the sizes and we went to another, we went to a spot, we made the shirts, they were high quality, they were really good, but yet right. um, it cost us more because we pre-ordered. Then yep. we hooked up with another store when we did the TFCon stuff and we had to lay out the money for a hundred shirts. That means we had to take all the data that we had from the four shirts or three shirts, whatever we had beforehand, put it in a system and come up with a plan of how many sizes we need that we've already sold, but we had to come up with a hundred. Right. So we took the forty or fifty or sixty shirts that we sold, and we put that data in, and then we had to bring it up to a hundred. So the two X's went five more. The three X's went this way. XL went that way. And you know, honestly, <laughs> think, thinking about who we are, and some of the fans in this group, in, in fandom and whatnot, we think higher sizes. And it was the low, lo, a lot of the lower sizes sold out really quick. Yeah. So that's why we were left with so many. And we came out of pocket for all that. We didn't right. get pre-orders. The Rock Pack was all out of pocket. All the members on the team came in, and we went all out of pocket to do that stuff. So um, we're going to crunch the numbers from last year, and that's why we put that poll in the group a couple of weeks ago if we do another Rock Pack. Right, yeah, size for our sizes. Want. Because we don't want to get left left over, you know. You know, we clearance a lot of the rock box out. Yeah, you know, we lost we lost some money on that well, stuff. I, so, I have two quick comments. One, as long as you don't order them from the same place where that Megatron T-shirt came from, <laughs> that went to the few. <laughs> oh no no no! They're not new. No, 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 no. I'm kidding. I'm, I'm joking. No, I know. Uh, and then uh, to as far as Mr. Uh, Energon Addict there, Dave. You know, he was like, oh, I'm ordering at least two, maybe three. I'm like, fuck you. I'm gonna order four. <laughs> <laughs> you got hey guys, I gotta be yeah. honest with you, man. Um, this is something that I feel so strong about. The last rock pack, I think I got like four or five. Yeah, I, and I think I actually picked up three myself because you always figure there's always going to be somebody that misses out and then they're going to be like, hey, I need one. And it's like, hey, you got an extra one? All right, there you go. Yep. There you go. Sure. You know? I bought, I bought, I was teetering between 2X and 3X at times. So I bought a 2X, I got a 3X. I bought an extra one to keep sealed. And then when we went to clearance prices, I bought another one at clearance price. <laughs> <laughs> See, we, we, we pay the guys that are part of this, that, that make this stuff, like, you know. We, we still pay we for pay, it. <laughs> we, pay, we don't get a free. We're still mm -hmm. putting out money into that shit. So. And it's a raffle, too. People forget about the raffle, I think. Yeah. yeah, yeah. and then we had the raffle. I mean, this year we got a lot of stuff, good stuff lined yeah. up. Um, uh, the rock pack is, is, is definitely changing, and it's, it's growing, and it's going to be a, a bigger thing. So. What's that? Is it a rock sack now? <laughs> I'm not gonna say anything. I'm not giving any away. I'm not, I'm not drinking that. No, he's he's, not, he's, he's, he's not easy, drunk enough for that shit. Yeah, boy. Yeah. <laughs> I may yeah. ramble on, but I ain't ramble yeah. on. But no, nah, nah, rest, rest assured, guys. There's, there's definitely a lot of good things that are in the pipeline that's gonna be coming up. So we just ask for patience. Like, trust us. You know, yeah. um, we you got know we got some good stuff coming. And you know what? We 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 definitely we we definitely say we dropped the ball that we didn't do a shirt in between. Mm -hmm. We should have did a summer shirt. We always try to do a shirt yeah, a quarter. We always try to do a shirt every year, three, four and months. We didn't know? do a shirt every quarter this year. Uh, we got caught up in other stuff, and everybody was doing something, and we had the glasses, and we had the hats, mm -hmm. and all that stuff. So we didn't do a shirt. And what our plan is to do like a, uh, a high quality, not like the, the the early stuff, but a high quality, just like that last shirt that we did with the, the multicolor. Like of, of, of the basic, the new, the revamped, the uh, new ROC logo, Realm of yeah. Collectors logo that just just worked so hard on, uh, with with the the, the vi vibrant colors and the you know the yeah. the better lettering and stuff like yeah. that. So, mm -hmm. and we're gonna have a stock shirt of that. So again, we're gonna have to come out of pocket because we get a better deal if we buy it by the hundreds. So we're gonna have to do a hundred and guess on sizes. Dust, can you make one with Wookie on it? 
Uh, <laughs> <laughs> you, you know that's gonna sell like you know five hundred. I, 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 I don't think the guys will go yeah. for it. I I can maybe do like five or six out of pocket for me. <laughs> that's that's, that's, that's gonna be a limited edition, and it's exactly. gonna cost fifty nine ninety nine. Yes, exactly. <laughs> Gary, you, want, you, want, you want the Wookie asshole? <laughs> when, 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 for the O on ROC, it's pet, 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 pet selfies gone wrong. <laughs> exactly what I was thinking. Much, what I was going to say. If you enjoyed the last rock pack and as much fun as we had with it, I think. I mean, you know, I think you'll you'll enjoy the new stuff that we're working on. You know, it's on the same lines. You know, we're not trying to top what we did last year. Because if you start setting precedences, you know what I mean. You're always trying to fucking get, <laughs> get you know, get to that level. But we're gonna bring you the same good stuff. I, I love it. I, I loved the little the little knickknacks. I mean, you knew you were getting a shirt, and that was about it going in. And then like all the other knickknacks, that was an awesome. Mm -hmm. Yeah, man. Yeah. And, and the yeah. price point was good. The price point may be a little higher this time because we're yeah. adding a little bit more That's stuff. Life. Yeah, I you know, think, yeah, like I think stuff, everybody's we're... gonna be okay with it. If it's thirty-five, if it's forty, like we're all, right. come up, we're going, we're all coming up with better it's, ideas. Yeah, you know what I mean? Gonna it's gonna be like, bigger. Oh, it's, hundreds it's of definitely... dollars to get yeah. there. So I think we're gonna. Uh, be... <laughs> it, it's it's definitely gonna be bigger and better, guys. You're you're gonna like what's coming. And what's if coming. you remember last year, you, if you don't go to TFCon, get those mules ready. Yep. Yeah. Your, your mule is ready. <laughs> Look, this is a, a great discussion, but uh, EE Prime, Eric, just messaged me and said, you know, kiss his ass. He only asked once <laughs> about the <laughs> 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 you know, fucking big deal out of it. You know, shout out to that dude because, you know, we're sitting there eating fucking wings at, at ToyCon and we're like, we're talking about it. I'm like, yeah, we got some good things planned. And I'm like, TFCon, we'll show you. And I'm like, he's like, when is the rug bag coming there? Gonna be that guy. Like that, right? <laughs> and I'm looking yeah, at I you mean, right now, bro. I'm looking but, at you right now. You're trying to be that guy. Dude, Russ, I'm just gonna leave you highlighted because your reactions, everything, just crack me. <laughs> I was gonna say I was, I was at that table and I don't remember that scenario. <laughs> you don't know? You don't remember us talking about the rock box? Oh no, I remember us talking about it, but I don't remember that reaction. <laughs> Which one? No, no, your impression of him. <laughs> oh. That was probably when you're trying to fucking play big dog and go pay the check on us, you motherfucker. Yeah, whatever. Yeah. <laughs> we ain't forgetting that one, man. We ain't forgetting that one. You're gonna get a beat down to TFCon. <laughs> That's fine. That's fine. Doc, you're going to get a fucking pillowcase party. Hey, shout out to Cole. Hey, whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> okay, once again, Dust, you got creepy again. <laughs> oh, I got creepy. That, I got creepy. <laughs> yeah, Gary, be, uh, be prepared to drink in DEC. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, <laughs> yeah I'll, have to, I'll plan accordingly. That's for sure. Be prepared <laughs> to look out for Brammer in DEC. <laughs> <laughs> it's oh, fucking oh, crazy, dude. Oh, 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 he's got a party going on. Be prepared to get stared at by businessmen. <laughs> <laughs> hey, guys, you, do you remember when we had the fucking party in the room with the pizza? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Little room. Yeah. You know how many motherfuckers we had in that little ass Yo. room? Oh, oh, your room where we were hanging out the, yeah, when you were yeah, yeah, we were hanging yeah, out. Yeah, yeah, before we went to Hanny's. I, yeah. paid, for, I, I paid for pizza and I never ate it because I never went back to the room. <laughs> Yo, it took like two and a half hours for that pizza to get. <laughs> Man, we had like eight, ten pies or twelve pies. They had, they had to milk the cow for the peas, man. Like, yeah, there was so were many of us man. in that room. God damn, there were a lot of people. All I did, all I did was scour the room. I'm like, all right, uh, Chris, Bobby, Adam, Kenny Prime, the Lux is in the corner. What the hell? Yeah, is the Lux is hanging out down there. Russ is there. Oh. This was there. I'm over here. Brammers with Bram. Oh, and he's <laughs> over by the bar. This isn't a big room. This is your basic two yeah. full size beds in a basic I room. Brought, I, brought a, I brought a bag of shot glasses into that room. And Brandon, <laughs> six of them. He in filled one. them all and drank them. <laughs> <one. laughs> <laughs> he really did. <laughs> I'm like, Look, I'm they're all for you. And, you know, we, we were in a different wing from the rest of the hotel. So it was a wing where the. Uh, the the stewardesses and the pilots were sleeping. Right, and it right. It was like, only Dude. like 7.30 at night, and they were like, 
Is it all about wings with you all the time? Yeah, of course. <laughs> all, wings every day. all wings all day. And, and like uh, they were knocking on the door telling us to keep it down at 730 at night because the yeah. pilot couldn't sleep next door. Like, I- a, a couple doors down from Handy's, we were like, we went outside the room for some reason. We were hanging out right outside, and a dude came out in nothing but his boxes and just glared at us. Whoa. <laughs> we're like, oh, we gotta get back to the room and shut up or something. Well, you know what? The way I see it is like, if you rent out a suite like Hanny did, Hanny's oh, room was like an apartment. Yep. Oh, yeah. Oh, it was like a yeah. four bedroom apartment. It had yeah, it was four sweet, dude. Big ass living room, a kitchen. Yep. A it had like two room. living rooms. That shit was dope. <laughs> it was, yeah, it was great. Was dope. Dude, wants to have some people in there at the hangout? Fuck mm. you. He paid yeah, for how much money he's putting down for that fucking room? Yeah, yeah, yeah. They eventually yeah. broke it up the uh, one night anyway, didn't they? It did. It did. I think it, yeah. I left before everything, before it all got broke up. But you weren't that loud. Uh, that's the thing. I mean, it was later, yeah. yeah it was, it was like three or nine. We weren't yeah. any louder than we were the whole night. I'm fucking known to hold a party to the end. So <laughs> I think I was last, it was like 3 a.m. And I was like, yeah, all right, we'll go. <laughs> <laughs> I think I was there. Pinkerton was there. I'm trying to remember who's there. Was, um, oh, <laughs> Ellis was there. I, 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 have a, I have a story to tell about oh, a dream. Oh, we got a TF. What, what, what story is this? No, it's, it's not a TF Con story. It, it's oh, a it's not a TF Con like about it like a week ago. So, um, obviously, in dreams, things are very different than they are in reality, right? So, for whatever reason, well, well, I was still moving. So, my situation was the same in the dream. So, you're dreaming that you're moving. My, my, my dream was, I, my reality was the same. But... For some reason, Chris Pinkerton was, he either had a giant RV or he was selling RVs. And like, I went to go like hang out in his RV and like, like a bunch of people from the ROC were there. But the main person that I remember in the dream was, was, was Chris. And so all of a sudden we got arrested for something and we're all in jail. <laughs> we're all in jail, but it's an outdoor jail and his RV is like parked to the side. So we would <laughs> go to the RV and like hang out. And then I found out that I was sentenced to eight years, and I was like, oh, no. Like, what about my apartment that I'm supposed to move out of? And Chris Pinkerton just, he kept coming up to me and be like, can't admit, it's going to be all right. And he would, like, like, give, me, like a toy. He would give me, like, a toy to hang out to, like, play with, or he gave me, like, a beer, and we are supposed to be in jail. <laughs> you know, Kenny, you know what? Right there, you're, that's Chris, man. That is Chris. <laughs> that's fucking yeah. Chris, bro. <laughs> So I, I, I think my my uh, my like conscious self knew that he was moving too, and he would be sort of vehicle to move. And in my mind, it was an RV. <laughs> but yeah, anyway, that was that was the short version of that dream. There was much more to it, but it was a good, like week and a half ago now. So I melatonin? I Were you on that melatonin? No, no, no. <laughs> sealed in my cabinet right now. <laughs> no terazidone, no melatonin. That was all of it. I think it's wonderful that you're dreaming about Chris and the rest of the ROC and, and a fucking party. <laughs> That's you know, love, it's, man. It's That's really love. weird. I haven't, I haven't it's talked love, to all right. I haven't talked to him in a like he hasn't been on like the show like last couple of times I've I've watched or anything. So like I don't know. I think it was just like the he just popped in there. Bribery of us moving around the same time. I'm sorry, you just popped in there. I don't know how to control this. Great. <laughs> I can't help it. Dude. All right, I've had a couple of beverages, but I came back and I saw something that Jose's holding and heard about dreams about Pinkerton. So, <laughs> yeah, it's fucking Kenny, dude. He, he's he's <laughs> dreaming right. about Chris Pinkerton, man. <laughs> it's, not even about, yeah. it's not even TFCon talk. We totally yeah. drifted off the TFCon talk and dream talk. Yeah, Chris is pretty dreamy. I can understand why. He's such a big. <laughs> 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 Yo, man, I got to tell you guys the first time, like, um, when we went to Charlotte, I've never yeah. met the, I've never met Chris before. I met Jay Roos. I met Ace. Out of everybody, this dude, I, I come out it, it's Charlotte. Uh, the departing flights is underneath, so they roll up. He's rolling up in that big ass white car. Is a charger that it, <laughs> music blast, and he pumps out. I'm like, oh my god, he's big, bitch. I'm big, big bitch. <laughs> this is the same thing. I, when I first met him. I was like, oh my fucking god, that's a, he's gigantic. Yeah. I didn't know. Oh, how, how, how big is Chris? He's how big is a dude? What is he like? Six oh, eleven? Ten? Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> ten? Ten? What? Two I don't know. Six Wait. five, six six, oh, probably. He's, he's, he's tall. Oh, so he's no. even taller than me. Okay. Oh, six five, yeah. Yeah, he's he's almost seven feet tall. Yeah. 
He sure yeah. seems like it. I'm fucking. I, don't know, I, I can hit him up. But I'm like, <laughs> I mean, my son, my son, I mean, my son is like six three, and six, he six, fucking probably like no, six, he six, makes six, my no, son look small, dude. Six six six, six seven. Hey, although, so. although, although we just we just got that uh, that love letter, uh, those many love letters to Energon Eddie. Eddie, while you were pissing, I was I was telling all the other guys oh. that um, <laughs> that. <laughs> That was, that, that, was that was a tiger. Tim, dude. What the fuck's going on here? That was a tiger. That was a tiger. It it it's so, now 5.30 in Germany. He, 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 he might have been getting Tim it. He might have been off the hook. Nah. He might have been getting another beer, you know? <laughs> so, what I was trying to say, What's that? Dave, Dave actually tried to get me to Washington this year. Yeah, well, he was trying. trying. He was trying to get Tim to come to the TFCon. Mm -hmm. Yeah, John Haddock? Yeah. Then he because... that cheerleader guy. Come on, man. You can make it. I know you can. Yeah, like that. Because, because <laughs> like, you know, you know what you tell him, Tim? You going to huh? flip the bill? You going to flip the bill? Yeah, yeah. He'll, shut, he'll shut up if you say that. Yeah, <laughs> I do, essentially. I, I just said, hey, I, I really want to, but um, even regulations, I couldn't. So I have, I have actually the plan to get TFCon Washington next year. Nice. I got that in the plan. Awesome. Well, we don't know if it's going to be Washington next year. Yeah, though. somewhere yeah, else. We'll see where it is, man. We'll definitely work it out. I better yeah, be so Chicago. I, I think they're making uh, Chicago. Dave and John Attic definitely will pay for your next airfare. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, Kenny, you think it's going to be back in Chicago again? I, I think that, well, so far they've done Chicago, Charlotte, Chicago, Washington. So I okay, think Chicago will be cool too. I think it'll be Chicago to be in the middle of the country, and then every other year it'll be a different spot. Well, you guys got to remember, this is a Canadian fucking yeah. convention. That's right. pretty close to them. It's it's based. It was originally from from uh, Toronto, so right. they came to the U.S. to try to gather those people. I think, but I honestly think I think they get better numbers when it's down like down where uh, D.C. or you know North Carolina. Honestly, I think my opinion is better numbers, man. But who do, what the fuck do I know? I'd like it if they did in Charlotte again. That'd be yeah, great. I'm so glad I don't have to fucking fly, man. Yeah, I'm me too. In the car, drive down there five hours. Woo woo. I like flying, so I won't mind wherever it is. Really. You know what? I don't. I don't mind flying either. I just don't want to pay to fly. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna be honest. I had, I had to pay for fucking first class last year, man, to Chicago. Yeah, you didn't have to. Well, it, it that that was the only flight that was in my schedule, and it was only a hundred dollars. Wait on it. It was only a hundred dollars more, so I was baller. <laughs> Nah, man, I, I didn't like the flight, and I didn't like paying for it. So fuck it, I'm glad I got for it. <laughs> it, 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 it. It takes so much fucking longer, yeah. man. It's like six yeah, it hours of your life. That's just to get on the plane. Well, getting yeah, because getting to the airport early and all that stuff, and everything you have to do with fucking security. You know, it was raining that day too when we left from New York. You know, so, and my girlfriend came with me last time. So, and we had turbulence on the flight getting there. So I could just imagine she was like, "Man, I'm gonna fucking die on this plane going to a fucking toy show." Jose, on a side note with that man, she was such a trooper, man. Yeah, she, she was. got along yeah. with all of us, and she was chilling. Oh, I'm glad, she, man. You know, and it's like, you know, I'm really glad I took the time and I sat there and I, and I talked to her for like almost 40 minutes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You guys, when I had the bar, yeah, man, I'm yeah. like, you know, just to, just to make that connection. You know, I, it wasn't like I just did it as like a job, man. I enjoyed really talking to her and hanging out there. But, you know, it was just so cool to like to make her feel like, you know what, you know. Oh, yeah. I, I, dudes, you know. Yep. I appreciate it, man. Like she really felt welcome, you know, because she's really not into this hobby. Like she doesn't really know anything about it. She was just kind of going just to kind of see what it was all about. And um, she had a good time, you know, despite not being into the subject matter. It just goes back to, again, what we say. It's about the community, all of it's us hanging community. out. Yeah, exactly. you know? It was awesome. Awesome. She had a great time. Let's, and I'm you glad know, you you guys, know, if yeah. you're going to the convention to just go in there, see what they got, get the exclusives and bounce. That's cool, man. Holla. Yep. But, you know, we're the dudes that are walking around that fucking room from open to close just to hang out with people. Yeah, just to talk yeah. and, yeah. Yeah, just yeah. mingle and say, hey, what'd you get? Uh, you know, I, I, I had my bags full and everyone was yelling at me to stop. <laughs> I've seen these tables a hundred times, but you know what? Fuck mm -hmm. it. You know, and then afterwards, after party. Mm -hmm. Sounds you good. Sit, same people, same chill, have a couple beers. 
And I'm going to tell you guys right now, TFCon, you are not going to get everybody together to have meals together. So don't even think about, hey, we're all going to eat together. It's not happening. There's too many events. Just break into groups and just go eat. And we'll meet up after. You know yeah. what I'm saying? You know? Every time we'd make plans, dude, everyone would end the people would just end up having it, other shit going on. Dude, there's just so yeah. many of us. How, yeah. how are you yeah. going to go into the restaurant and say, we got 74? <laughs> right. <laughs> Red table to 74, please. <laughs> yeah. I'm not yeah. I'd like to do it and see what happens. Yeah. <laughs> the, 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 the same, thing, Charlotte, really? the same, same amount of people, like too many to do anything with? What's that? Was it the same kind of deal in Charlotte? Was there too many people to do anything like that with? What do you mean? Like to no, 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 no. We definitely grew when we went to Chicago. Yeah. I okay. mean, there was a lot of us. There was a lot of us down there, but we definitely grew when we went to Chicago. It was like incredible. It's like every we were all trying to be on the same page, and then you know you had like you know us, SCU, everybody, like everybody in the fandom. You know, like we were just all trying to just be chill and be like, because we're all hanging together. Oh man, we need to do no. You got to throw that shit out the window. Don't take feelings. Just let it go. Just let it go. You're right. It's kind of like right. NJCC. When everybody comes to NJCC and the numbers are so big, we're not going to get a fucking table for 40. Yeah. Just, just go point. when you can. Just go eat. Little groups together. We'll meet up yeah. afterwards. Just you don't eat that I mean? fucking restaurant at the goddamn hotel. Yeah, well, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> we don't eat that fucking assholes. Them, you know, it just, it just gets to the point like you just like, you know, I'm not going to be the guy to broker this. We can't have this. Way, it's just way too many people. So just yeah. break off and do your thing. We'll meet up afterwards, you know? Absolutely. Yeah, get yourself a little group together and go, okay, let's go. Right. Yeah, it's like, <laughs> you weren't there at the fucking dinner. Oh, I'm sorry, man. I, yeah. I but but I wanted you to eat with us. I'm sorry, dude. <laughs> so much, I mean, at least, at least when I was there, you pretty much had, like hang out with – like your roommate or a few people like me me and matt we like ate breakfast together a couple of days we had dinner like at least one night like we all we went and found a, a restaurant or something like that so but we all ended up hanging out after well can you saw me i was trying to i was all over the place man i was just fucking yeah you like weren't eating everybody you were man. like oh, i haven't eaten yet like well why because i'm hanging out with everybody yeah yeah, <laughs> yeah that's, that's true like, the fattest guy is the last one to eat <laughs> <laughs> Dust, eat something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll, I'll get something later, man. I'm good. I'm good. I'm gonna go over there with these guys. Hold on. It's like I'm fucking spinning plates. <laughs> Next year, you guys are coming to me. You're coming to me this year. You're gonna be the Don cool. in the corner. <laughs> yeah, I want to be fucking petting Wookie. <laughs> <laughs> Well, the good news is this year at the hotel where it's at, there's there's things in walking distance that are pretty close, and it's actually a nice area. It's not like in Chicago where you got to worry about getting mugged or anything like that. No, no, no. Chicago, that area. Hey, listen, I, I lived in Chicago. I take I take I take that personally. Walk down because two years ago or three years ago. Now, I stayed at a hotel down the road, and so we went down there, and there's this whole, like, courtyard of, like, restaurants and shit, and, like, that's where we went for, for I forget what the place was, but like, we went for lunch and dinner one time. We were there. That was an awesome spot, so, like, if it does indeed go back there, which I have a feeling it will be, like I said, uh, there's plenty of options, and everybody wanted to order from all the deep dish places that take 75 years to, you know, make their pizzas, but there's a lot... <laughs> <laughs> There's a lot more options. No, it happened every single night. Everybody was waiting on pizza for like two. Yeah. I don't know. To be honest with you, now that I've had it, oh, I'm not that impressed. It's alright. You, know, you know what? You know what? I've made better lasagnas. Yeah, there you go. Fuck yeah. it, was, it was a lasagna with bread underneath. That's exactly it. what it was. Yeah. It was good because was I was drunk right. as fuck and I was hungry as a motherfucker. Yeah. Yep. Yep. <laughs> there you go. I think I had like fuck, three meals that whole fucking weekend. <laughs> yeah, but it's it was good. I don't know. Everyone kept telling me if you're going to Chicago, you gotta try deep dish pizza. I'm like, oh, fuck off. Yeah. You know what? <laughs> if you're going to Chicago, <laughs> try my deep dish. You'd find better. <laughs> <laughs> like I said, I'll give you two five times, baby. <laughs> I'll two, tell you. You're you're adding a one. It was two yeah, times four whatever, earlier whatever. today. Come on, don't fuck with me. I'm drinking. Man. <laughs> Fucking coffee. I'll man. tell you the area. I'll, I'll, I'll make sure that you guys eat, eat from here next time. If, if it's there. Man, I can't wait, man. I just can't wait to chill, hang out. Yeah. Oh, man. Time, it's closer. Man. 
it'll, we, we always, it'll be fun to collect more stories. That's what I like about it. What's we, that? It's, it'll be cool just to have more story, more yeah, like we awesome gotta stories, have a buddy you know? system just for Brammer. <laughs> oh, fuck well, me, man. Oh, God. <laughs> well, hopefully we won't have that issue. And you know what? I'm all about people hanging out, and having a good time, but. Take the OC shirt off and put it inside. I don't know, dude. He 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 texted me Sunday morning, dude. It was like, dude, what happened? I don't even remember getting into my room. I'm like, motherfucker, don't even get me started. What happened? Yeah, yeah. yeah. You know what? Let's just keep rolling on the positive. Keep it positive. <laughs> <laughs> he had a good time. Yeah, I think we can all we can laugh about him now. Yeah, uh, love that positive, man. Yeah, yeah it was man. all right, though. Yeah, bro. It was good times, man. It was good times. Definitely good times for sure. Like I can't wait like for the for the people that are coming, like Gary and and um E E Prime, you know, that are coming for the first time. Like I can't wait to see like their reaction to everything. Cause like when you when you're there for the first time hanging out with everybody, it's an awesome experience. Oh dude, I, sure. I, I can't wait. I, I keep talking to Dave and he's like, dude, you gotta prep. You gotta get ready. You gotta you gotta pace yourself. Yeah. <laughs> gotta yeah. pace yourself. Like, look at Dave, Coach Dave. All right. <laughs> I'll do it. No, I already told him. I'm like, listen, I'm gonna, I'm gonna get it on Friday. I'll be there Friday night, you know, through Sunday. He's like, okay, don't get it too early because you'll be tired on Friday. <laughs> <laughs> he's coaching. You know, he's seasonal veteran, I guess. There, so he's got. To- <laughs> See, originally I was going to take my vacation, starting oh. TF Con, and go over that. I think what I'm going to do is going to do like I did last year. Vacation early into TFCon, right? Because I'll have those extra days earlier to go hang out earlier. We're trying to figure out what's going on. We may go down earlier, hang out at Pickerton's for a day or so, and then because he's like fucking two hours from the fucking venue, or even yeah, less than that. Because isn't he over by Bobby now? Yeah, he moved. To, he moved. Yeah. yeah, he's he's like maybe forty minutes, uh, maybe thirty. Yeah. I, don't, I don't know the exact he's, time, yeah, but he's, he's, he's right he's there. Pretty close. He's close. He's right yeah, in he's Maryland, close. so. Believe it or not, I think he's closer. I think he's closer than I am where where I live. <laughs> well, Maryland, Mar- so. for me, Mar- Maryland, where where those dudes are out, r- round about is about three and a half hours for me. Yeah, it's gonna be yeah. a four hour four hour so, track for us here in the city. You know, so, so getting there and then you're like, it's only probably like an hour or so from there to get to the fucking con. So, I don't know. We're working out some shit, man. So I'm gonna take my vacation going into it. So if we do work something out and go chill there. You know, I'm available. You know, I don't mind coming home on Sunday and going back to work on Monday. I've been doing that forever, you know? Yeah. Yeah, but, yeah man, it's going to be back. some good times, man. This is, this is it, man. Make or break, man. This is going to be the big one. Three years in the making. ROC is going to be three years old, go, working on three years old. Our third yeah. PF Con. Um, let's make this fucking – let's it's make this huge. work. Let's show it's everybody what they want to do in their area for fucking – Doing these meetups and whatnot, you know, because yep. that's what it's all about. Yeah, it's yep. gonna be crazy, man. I, yeah. I I just can't wait to see the turnout we get with a lot of people coming. <laughs> yeah, man. You know what? And we didn't put we didn't really push too much for the T- the Toronto stuff because we're not we know a lot of people up there aren't going. Yeah. But then I'm looking. I'm like, all right, you know, this dude went, that dude went, you know. Yeah. Because yeah. he lives right right there, but that, that's the only one I've seen anyway. I am Who? sure. Matt Ellis. I saw, I saw, yeah, yeah, I Matt, saw Tyler yeah. F. Matt. I, saw Tyler, I didn't know Tyler F. was going. Yeah, Scott I didn't Gibbons. know Tyler was going to be there either. Yeah, Gibbons went, you know? Yep, I was like, wow, there. That's cool. surprised. Like, you mm-hmm. know? It's pretty nice, dude. That's pretty, pretty nice. cool. Yeah. Yeah. Um, Alan went. I wouldn't mind going to one in Toronto, I guess. It would. I think I just don't feel like having to fuck around and go go to can go to Canada. <laughs> yeah, man, I'm fucking around with the fucking dude. border, and you know. Yeah, I, I was gonna go like four or five years ago. You know what, Russ? I don't like the way your fucking eyebrow hair looks. Yeah, yeah, I'm no. not letting you in. Yeah, I know. It's like fuck that, man. I went Donald Trump too. I'm like, fuck up the country or something. Yeah, you look like a felon with that eyebrow. Yeah, you sound like a felon. Hey, there's a story like uh, me and Steele drove back in the day. We drove up to Montreal. I know I told the story a hundred times before, whatever. Um, we got into Montreal. There's nothing English. We don't understand anything. Everything's in French. We go to something that says casino. We go to the casino. We go to go in. They told me I can't enter the casino because I have violent clothing on. I was in a pair of jean shorts, t-shirt, flannel with a hat backwards. 
like <laughs> all right, all right. I, end the story. End the story. The next, morning, the next morning, we woke up, said, fuck this shit. We got our fucking money back, and we drove back home. That, that was our week in Montreal. It lasted 24 fucking hours, if that. What the fuck? Yeah, I, I, I know I've told that. St- it, the story goes more in depth. But I know I've discussed that story a ton of times before in these hangouts. And I don't want to just repeat myself, but... I'm, I'm trying to figure out how the fuck clothing is violent. I'm yeah. to... I don't know. I know. It was, uh, I'm trying to think what it is. It, it had to be 98, maybe? 97, 98? It was before, I think it was before I got married. I don't remember, man. It was just... Is it, yeah, they said I had violent clothing on because I had a hat backwards, a t-shirt, a flannel, and some shorts. So what I did was I went back to the car. Yeah, Eddie, a because you went. Eddie, that was a pair of jeans. I'm sorry, what's up? That because you originally looked like Fred Durst, like break stuff all the time. Yeah, yeah, Chains, yeah. yeah. You know, that's on your face and stuff like that. Durst and break stuff. <laughs> Hey like, Tim, stop, dude. That's not a, that's that's an insult when you say people look like Fred Durst. <laughs> yeah, you know what? No, Russ, Russ, Russ. It was a different country. I didn't want us to get thrown in the gulag. Yeah, I can understand that. I mean, yeah, I don't get that. I get that. And I get that. You know, I'd be trapped in the system for fucking sixteen years because I was wearing my hat back. So I it's took fucking my hat retarded, off. Didn't it? I tucked the flannel into the jeans that I put on. And I was okay. <laughs> I was all right to go in. Hold on, wait, wait, wait. See, <laughs> so you went changed into some jeans instead of jean shorts, right? Yep. I put and on you, I put on you, jeans. And you tucked your shirt in. I tucked the flannel in. Did you turn the hat around frontwards? I had no hat. I took you had hat no hat. You, oh, you showed that beautiful fucking head no there. Hat. Yep, yep, yep. The, the, the mane sexy was flowing. Beast, baby. The mane wow. was flowing. You know, Did back in the day. Tank? Back in the day, I didn't have the mane. I didn't start growing this till about fucking five years ago. So, so they were like, they're like, oh, okay, he's okay now. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. And it, and we went walk right past the same fucking security guards, and I'm like, what's up, son? <laughs> That's hilarious, dude. God, dude, man, I'm never going to Canada. I'm gonna tell you right now, man. I I have never had such a fucking miserable time that I did from there, man. Oh, you really? Americans, you want double cheeseburger? I felt like the blackest dude in the whitest neighborhood. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to tell you right now, and I, and I said this before, you know, he looked at us like we were the fucking epitome of the worst fucking oh, piece God, of shit because it's that French state. It, everything yeah. was French. And when you look on the walls, and I know I've discussed it before, it'd be like English. Crossed, this is graffiti. English crossed out Francaise. Francaise crossed out English. And there was a battle back then between the English side and the French side. Yeah, and we just happened wow. to just get caught up in all that bullshit and like because we were Americans. And you could That's tell cool. we were Americans because we weren't 89 pounds. We didn't smoke, had bad teeth, <laughs> greasy hair, <laughs> and had bad leather jackets. <laughs> <laughs> That's all I saw from Montreal. <laughs> Dude, that's class. all I saw from Montreal. You know, and, and this is Rolling Steel. Uh, this is Brian. Brian's with me, and like, you know, you know how we are, man. We're having a good time. I'm throwing grit up graffiti stickers, and we're going to the comic store. Said it was open to nine. We walk in eight oh five. We're closing. <laughs> what do you mean we're closing? It says you're open till nine. Yeah, we're closing early. What the fuck? And I'm telling you guys, I'm not making it up. I'm being fucking dead honest with you. And then we walk into the, like the, the underground mall. There's like a mall under the city. We walk into the mall. We go to a cheeseburger place. Oh, you're Americans. You want double cheeseburger? The oh, fuck out of here with that oh, shit. Oh shit, that's crazy. So, you know, we I mean, got back I, I to mean, the I mean, I do want a double cheeseburger, but damn. yeah, yeah, of course. Of course. I was like, yeah. <laughs> but you know what? You know, I, we got back to the hotel, and like Brian was like, you know, you want to go out tonight? We'll go to a strip club. I'm like, man, I ain't getting fucked. I ain't fucking with nobody here because we'll wind up in the fucking Canadian gulag and be fucking <laughs> trapped for 20 years. Yeah. I, 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 I was like, bro, I was like, bro, I don't feel comfortable here. We drove nine hours here. Why don't we just get our money back? You know, because we had to change over the money. Let's get our money back and just let's drive through fucking through fucking Maine and fucking Rhode Island and Massachusetts. We'll go to Boston. We'll have more fun doing that than being here. 
Because, you yeah. know, we planned on being there for a week. You know, being yeah. that we got ass raped going through the country, like this is back before 9-11. <laughs> So this was before 9-11. So we got uh, ass rape going into the country anyway because we were young guys in a rental car. Right, of course. Of course. You know what I'm saying? And yeah. then when we came back, we drove we drove across Canada, came through New York, like like where New York would be, like Maine and all that shit. And it was like more more uh US, the border was more US and they're like, Well, it says on the computer that you're gonna be here for like a week. Why are you leaving the next day? And I said, honestly. The fucking people in Montreal are fucking rude. He's like, yeah, I got you. Go. I, he said, agreed. Let's go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. go he was like, we understand. Leave. <laughs> you know, wow. Like, oh, man. You know, it, I mean, I'm not trying to diss Canadian people at all. It's it's a different providence of Canada. 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 <laughs> Montreal is very, it's, it, it, it's, it's, and I, and I do believe from what I know, they want to exclude themselves from the rest of Canada because they're French. Yeah. It's that whole French bullshit. And remember, this is this is before 9-11. When was 9-11? 2001. 2001. So it was before. It was like it was probably like 2000 or 99. I think it was either before I got married or right after I got married. Time travel. Yeah, man. So it's just like, man, what a fucking experience, man. It was the worst fucking experience I've ever had. And you know what? We probably would have had a lot more fun if we would have drove, just drove five more hours and went to T dot. Toronto, I heard it's off the hook because it's very U.S. oriented. So yeah, well, it's it's closer to the border. That's why. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, yeah, but you know what? Montreal yeah. isn't that far from the border either. It's just it's not got that true. French bullshit. Yeah, maybe you're right. This is by the Frenchies. The Frenchies are assholes. What can you say, dude? <laughs> For all hey, hate, Alias, yeah, send it to me. I know. Okay. <laughs> I mean, but you know what? Then again, you know, uh, me and him. Back in the day, we were collecting a lot of action figures. We were stopping at Toys R Us's and all the stores. Right. So what would it took us nine hours probably took us about 15 from all the stops. And, <laughs> and we just came back. We went through fucking, you know, Rhode Island, Massachusetts, all that, man. We just stopped at the WD, WWF building at the time. And, you know, we took some pictures there. And, you know, coming back was a really good time. So that was that was a better time for us. And, you know, like out of nowhere, it was just like – he didn't have the kids. He didn't have the family. I wasn't doing anything. What do you want to do this weekend? Let's go to Canada. All right, let's go. That's, That's back in the day before, before cell phones and all that Google Maps and what we had a map quest shit, you know, off the computer, you know. So it was a different time. So it just it was just a really cool adventure that we had. But it is really funny. It seems like the French are pretty much rude all around the world. Yep. Oh, they root for you too? <laughs> Not for me. I can't I can't tell from experience like at first hand, but I only heard from certain friends they said when we were riding to Paris and we were said we were German or they heard we have like we have to speak English with a German accent. They were like, Oh yeah, those two souls are German. Yeah, uh, we we're closing up early today. Yeah, so, see, you too. That's okay, the same yeah, thing. but hold on, Tim. But you guys did kind of invade them back in the day. You know what I'm saying? Oh, yeah. <laughs> I mean, you know, Russ, World War II is kind of had to go there. there. Hey, Russ, I tell you what. We Germans now have a saying. We did not fucking invade anybody. <laughs> they did. <laughs> good, 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 good point. That's, that's, a, that's a good way to put it, too. I mean, I know, we, uh, I know my, 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 my people... Like strong exclamation marks front to back. We were fucking rude and fucking assholes, like putting shit everywhere. But I and myself and everybody else, we didn't invade fucking anybody. <laughs> I hear you, brother. He's like, fuck you, we weren't alive. Kiss my ass. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, exactly. That's what we're doing. Exactly. Yeah. yeah, you know, they're almost all said and gone, so leave us alone. Pretty much, yeah. yeah. No, I get yeah. that. So yeah, that's pretty good. He's a Russian guy. We didn't invade anybody. Uh, uh, being <laughs> half German and Irish, I do have another story, but it's going to be for another podcast. Yeah, it, <laughs> let, me, let, let, me, let me let me only short that out because the the fun the funny part is I I know pretty much all the all over the world everybody's going like okay they're German so what the hell they're like crowds they're drinking beer they're eating breakfast so what the hell. But only the German politicians, only the German politicians are thinking we are still brown, we are still Nazi to the world. We have to behave a certain way like this. While the rest of the world says yeah. this yeah. is going like 70, 80, 
80 years. So what the yeah. fuck? Yeah, how long how long are you gonna be fucking hiding in the shadows before you can just be yourselves again? Exactly. Uh, yeah, yeah, I agree, exactly. man. I agree hundred percent, man. It's it, it said it's gone, the generations are over. Yeah. And now we have to think past that and, and think about the future. I mean, this is all multinational. You can get anywhere so yep. easy. I mean, I just looked it up. If I even wanted to get to Washington DC to TFCon this this year, I could get over there for seven hundred bucks and not even two thousand. Only for a theory. <laughs> So it is pretty easy. It is all way more connected. Why still get this shit all over divided? Yeah, I don't no get out. Nah, that's okay, Tim. They they kind of deserve to be invaded anyway. Because guys like <laughs> Russ have to bring have to bring up the fuck. <laughs> 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 Damn it, Russ! Fuck you, assholes! <laughs> that's that's the the was, guy, man. You know, <laughs> hey, hey, French guy. There was that time that those guys were coming down the main avenue with the tank. Yeah, and you pretty <laughs> much deserve it. So what the fuck? <laughs> and then Russ is like, you know what? There is that time that we came in there and sweep these motherfuckers out, and save the world. That's right. <laughs> yeah, man, it's hey, we, have a, we, have a, we have a say it does. We didn't do shit. <laughs> didn't, yeah, that's a new thing. That's a new thing. That's a new shit. Either. We didn't do any shit. No, nope. they did it. <laughs> they did. <laughs> Tim, that's great, man. From now it's on, awesome, it's like, you know, like, I'm going to pass the buck and be like, you know what? I didn't do shit. Yeah, that's right. That's we did. I mean, okay, we, we, we did save your asses, but you kind of deserved it. <laughs> <laughs> whoa, 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 what? That's that's what. We're <laughs> well, yeah, the, the French, well, I mean, that's me. My thinking is the French are assholes, and so they. It's hard to be sympathetic <laughs> to anything that happens to yo, them. Yo, <laughs> yo, shout out to Empty Collector in the chat. He says, "What the heck? What the heck? This kind of conversation did I stumble into? You guys are going to war." Word. You guys. <laughs> When Americans refused to call them French fries, and we called them Freedom fries. <laughs> oh yeah, they were they were, they were bad. You know, I was like, fuck off. Man, the French are the worst, man. Fuck you. <laughs> All right, MB Collector, uh, we need you to uh, take Squad A over to. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> it's the rock going to war. That's hell yeah, best. man. Every day, all day. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, but serious, everybody's getting over it. So what the hell? Yeah, man. Me, you know, you know, it's it's in the past, man. People still hold fucking hold grudges. That generation's pretty much almost really done. Yeah, you know. Um, and yeah. uh, myself being half German, half Irish, when I was growing up back in the day, um, I did get some fucking flack for being German and being a little overweight. The worst thing when I was in elementary school, somebody said that I was uh, the German Hindenburg. For real? Yeah, yeah. They, 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 that was his biggest. That was his biggest thing. You German Hindenburg, and that hurt me because I was a big, I was an overweight kid, and I was German. Yeah, you should have so, big splashed that ass. Yeah, I don't give a fuck, man. That was. <laughs> you, call no you call me what? You call me anything, but don't call me late for dinner. Yeah, I don't give a fuck. What you say? <laughs> Hey, Dustin, uh, did you only do you only have German roots, or did you live in Germany once too? No, no, not at all, man. I'm a German. I'm American, German, Irish. Okay. You know, so no, no, but I do have some older bullshit that went down. My uh, grandmother <laughs> and, and, and whatnot, but that's that. Like I said, that's a podcast for another story. Uh, yeah, that's or, a that's that's podcast for another story. <laughs> Whatever the fuck. <laughs> Beers and bullshit, baby. Beers, Beers and bullshit, bullshit, baby. It's good. That's it. Gary, get off your fucking phone. We're talking. We're talking. All right, guys. We're approaching the two hour. We're, we're well over the two hour oh, mark. You guys want to yeah, discuss yeah. anything else? Keep it going or wrap it up and we can just blow this on broadcast and chill? I don't give a fuck. I don't give a fuck either. That makes I mean, three of us. I don't give a fuck. <laughs> you, know, you know, nobody. I'm. I'm. Uh, I haven't checked my phone in a bit, but you know. I don't even know if anyone's. The link old, is old. out there, and uh, maybe I should put the link in the ROC Facebook group and see what's up. Do we have anyone, uh, anybody else? Is no. there anyone watching? I mean, I don't know if say anybody. <laughs> we, we, we got some people watching. We got some people yeah, in the who chat. Cares? Yeah, we have we have five to fifteen viewers currently. So there's plenty of people in the chat, plenty of people hanging out, man. This is just, uh, you know, fuck it, man. We're Wait, can we can we talk about that stuffed animal that's on Russ's couch? <laughs> Which one? Hold on, hold on. I don't know. What is that this, thing? This one back this here? Yeah. <laughs> oh, that's... 
It's a magenta it's my bear, dude. bear. It's my bear. Is it this one or is it the, is it the banana, the Jamaican banana guy? Probably the Jamaican okay, banana. Because you yeah, he's know what, Russ? You, you, you're like making me crazy. Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> it's like a Rastafarian banana, dude. What's up? Yeah. Yeah. Sounds, sounds like Dave Clone. Kind of. Anyway. <laughs> 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 Real quick, I'm just going to show you uh, on beers and where we at tonight. <laughs> Whoa! Jesus Christ, Dust. Look at that collection. Wait, e even even yeah. Wookie is amazing. Wookie's chilling here. Yeah, no, Wookie's like, like, damn, man. What a mess. Mine. So, you know, that's, that's what we're working with tonight. No, so. Here's what Wookie's thinking. You've embarrassed us both. <laughs> yeah, <no problem. laughs> oh, you, oh, you're going to still stand there and fucking talk like that? <laughs> Get over it, kid. Go to bed. <laughs> Fucking awesome, dude. Even though Wookie's a girl, she still talks like this. She talks like Ben. You know, I, I nowadays I think it's like Ben Affleck's Batman. It's like tails. Shout it's out to the Wookie. Batman. Batman. Come here, come here. I don't know, man. We talked about a lot of shit, it's man. We talked, bad, and we got on that TFCon stuff, and I'm really hoping people take it and and listen to what we're saying. It's, you know, am I saying it's worth three thousand dollars? No, it's probably worth three thousand dollars, but you know, look, look. Somehow we took beers and bullshit to talk about, uh, you know, politics and history. <laughs> <laughs> you were like a bad rash. We're everywhere, you know. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry, I didn't mean. I didn't mean the yeah, source yeah, yeah. Russ, Russ is just like, yeah, yeah, man, just like those Nazis. Damn it, <laughs> 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 Damn it Russ! Damn it, Russ! Oh, God. <laughs> 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 Look, look, look. Let's be fair. Russ has a Mitsubishi with a dent in it, so he he's got every right to be angry. <laughs> no, 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 no. no. Anna <laughs> has a Mitsubishi with a dent. Right? Yeah. Not me. <laughs> you know what? Oh, about Pearl Harbor, though. You know. I know my name is on the car, but it's not my well, car. It's yours. Remember <laughs> Okinawa. All right. Remember hey. Okinawa. Hey, you know what? Let me tell you. That's why Japanese, we were there. They recovered. They they build good cars. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> they recovered. <laughs> 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 oh man, you know what? I, I, I mean, I'd say we just, we could go five more fucking hours, but you know, we have in the past. Yeah, we have in the past, not broadcasted. Nope. We're just trying to keep the people in, you know, in line here, man. The chat's dying down. We got about fifteen viewers live right now, so maybe it's time we take this. it back. Take this. it back. Do 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 do. Take, take it, back. it back. Anybody remembers that? Yeah. What's that from? Creed. No, yeah, actually, no, Rocky. It, it, it Rocky. was actually Rocky, the first Rocky. Rocky. Yeah, Rocky. It was some yep. cunts. Hmm. What? <laughs> did you say cunts again? Did Stop say saying that. Did you say cunt? Oh, man, <laughs> fuck that, man. You guys are done, man. We're not even going to do outro. Oh, We're just fucking... <laughs> <laughs> no, nah, honestly, man. I mean, we we've been here. Let's get some outros going right now. Let's just. I hate to wrap this up, but I really like to keep it going. But you know, I think two hours is enough. Yeah. Sure. No uh, Okay. So Gary's not there. So I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go right to left, and it starts with me. Hey, everybody, what's up? My name is Uncle Dust, aka Dust Mites. You can find me on Instagram at Dust Mites. Eddie Dust Mites in the Facebook groups. Enter the realm Monday nights, lurking in the back of the ROC hangouts, being the man behind the camera, making sure shit's working off well and people are leaving when they should. Uh, that's what I do. And thank you guys for showing up here tonight for beers and bullshits. Had a great time. A little loosey-goosey, but who gives a fuck? And next <laughs> up, Tim K. Yeah. Tell us where you at soon. I am currently in Bremen, Germany, but on the interwebs, I am at Instagram, at Figure Photography Crate, same on Facebook, and Tim K on my private profile. Shout out to EE Prime for that live follow. Thanks a lot. So, having a great time. See you guys soon. What time is it over there, bro? It's like it 6 a.m. <laughs> It's 7.30 no. a.m. and I'm going to no. get some fucking... No, no. <laughs> One hour. <laughs> and some fucking shishos and... 
It's 5.16 a.m. currently. Well, thank you very yeah. much for hanging out with us, yeah, man. We appreciate making it, Tim. Yeah. Thank you it's very awesome. much for having what me. What happens when the vacation's over? Where's Tim's been? I don't know. We haven't seen Tim in a while. Yeah, we're not going to see Tim forever. <laughs> Where's <laughs> Cricket? Oh, cricket? Oh. Cricket? <laughs> no, you will see me. I am not going anywhere. You're like oh, a cool. bad rash. I like Exactly it. like that. <laughs> All right, we're gonna keep continuing, 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 continuing from left. Russ the Mus. What's up, guys? You gonna? I guess you. I guess where are we saying where we can be found at? What? <laughs> you can find me on Facebook and Instagram, and I like to tweet. <laughs> no, not twat, Tim. Tweet. Twat, Russ. Do you twat that again? Twat? Tweet, Russ. Russ, are you in Twitter? I'm on Twitter, but I don't. I don't post a lot of Transformer stuff up. That's yeah, just man, I fucking dropped Twitter like a year ago, man. I'm just like I. I ain't fucking with this. Yeah, mostly I'm on it because I like to follow celebrity garbage. Yeah, and- well, you know what? That's it. That seems like, <laughs> no, Twitter seems like it, it's very big for if you if you're a fucking star fucker. Yeah, I am. I'm you a star fucker. If you're a star <laughs> fucker, you want to follow some celebrities and whatnot, and like, yeah. Then you got us, like the guys, like in hip hop that aren't making that much money or underground this, and everybody thinks I got a Twitter. Okay, and <laughs> or, or you're DMX and you're making a lot of money and not paying any taxes and you're gonna go to Shout jail. To DMX. <laughs> All right, we're gonna no. roll it up to KP in the house. Kenny Prime. Hey, I'm Kenny Prime and I do things. And <laughs> <laughs> do you do things or do you uh, uh, do things? No. <laughs> Sorry, guys. Yikes. I mostly do things on Instagram at Kenny Prime. At oh, Kenny God. Prime, one word. One word, no underscores, no double underscores, as some of us like to use. <laughs> underscore, underscore, underscore. Uh, <laughs> caption, underscores, underscores, dick caption. scores, and four scores for more. And uh, sh- shout out to Harvey Dent. Shout, shout out to Harvey Dent. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, Kenny, thank you very much for joining us, and. Uh, I mean, I can't wait for you to get home. What's that next month? Uh, this weekend. Well, weekend. This weekend. Yep. I, I thought it was like four weeks from now. Uh, <laughs> I thought you were the guy that quit his yep. job and like I, I got two months ago, before I go so. home. So I, I just wanted to see you. I, I was hoping that we could see you. Like, I quit my job. My bank account's good, and then four weeks later, you're eating fucking peanut butter and crackers. I mean, that might be the case. We're just in the first week of that, though. Yeah, well, you know what? <laughs> that, that might be like a, a, a spotlight we may have to do. All right. Where's Kenny Prime? Meet up in the crackers. crackers. Yeah. <laughs> All right. This is a hopeful because I haven't seen him in a minute, but Harrigan BX, he's still there? Yeah. Oh, he's, he's still there. The- All right, guys. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. You know, he went off video a while ago, so I was just hoping <laughs> that he's still there. <laughs> yeah, what's up, everybody? Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, all at Harrick and BX. And uh, please tune into the ROC Hangout every single Tuesday night, 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Definitely this week. Because yeah. We're talking yeah. DFCon review. Yeah, it's going to be a lot. It's going to be talk. about, <laughs> a, lot about a half hour. From when yeah, I was saying half hour. Yeah, it's gonna be about a half. Hour. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I mean, I mean, if you compile everything that we already discussed, because we've seen everything already, then eh, maybe about an hour and a half. Yeah, but you know, yeah. it's gonna be much more yapping about yeah, shit. Well, you know, we're gonna keep it <laughs> limited to like a three-man show. So raffles are going live tomorrow. <laughs> yeah. Right. <laughs> so then your dollar fifty to dust mites at <laughs> PayPal info. You're so and, entrepreneurial. Um, I'll figure it out. Right. I gotta get something out of this fucking shit. If, 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 if anyone sends a phoenix, their chances of winning are much greater. G, don't G. I'm I'm doing your outro. Don't talk over me. G money. What's up, everybody? Um, yeah, listen, uh, just on Facebook and then here on Tuesdays going forward, and uh, that's it. I'm quick and easy. G Money, I, I really, I'm really happy that you embrace the G Money name and that you're fitting in, you're getting in here, and you're feeling how it is, man. I love it, man. I love show, it. Show people out there, 
The Hangouts, come on in. Come on Listen, in. Listen, I, I, I got to tell everyone, it so sounds cool. very cliche, and it's going to be a bit repetitive, but everyone, Energon Addict, um, anyone else who's kind of talked before me and mentioned about what it takes to kind of join, it's easy. Don't be concerned. Don't be worried. Uh, you know, reach out. It's, uh, it's, it's a great experience all the way around. Just be you, man. Yep. Just be fucking you. Absolutely. Absolutely. Yep. That's it, man. 100%. Don't be some fabricated bullshit and... And yeah. flex your chest, you know, just be you and just hang with us, man. Just uh, we don't bite, man. Well, yeah. a no, little bit, man. Fuck it, man. <laughs> I mean, if anybody knows from tonight, they just. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I really hope everybody had a good time tonight, man. I know I was a little fucking laughing at the gums, but you know, that's just me. Just be me and be and me, man. Just having a good time with you guys, and definitely, I really appreciate everybody and, and you know everybody that's part of this and. It really makes me, you know, happy, and I smile. You know, like as much as I hate this fucking shit, I love it to death. <laughs> it's a full time job on top of a full time job, but man, you know, just hearing what you guys say and how much um, you you get inspired, and you know, it just makes me so happy, man. This is what it was all about. This was all the dream. It was all a dream. <laughs> you know, so uh, thank you guys. I really appreciate you all. Definitely. Yes, yes. Yep. Like that. Thank you very uh, much. <laughs> fuck Dave. <laughs> fuck Dom. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> fuck Dom. We got Dom. a new one. Hashtag fuck Dom. There you go. Where's Dom right now? I don't know. So no, <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys, thank you for joining us. This was uh, Beers and Bullshucks, uh, about two hours and a half. Wow, two and a half hours. Not too bad, man. Long show. Uh, you oh, know, uh, shout out to the Cool Table Network. Everybody knows who the fuck they are. I'm not going to do that jabber, jabber, jing, jang. Into the realm on Monday, we're going to talk TFCon, and then uh, hang out on Tuesday, we're going to talk TFCon. Yep. So, um, you know, and if you want to hear us, what we're talking about, those slides that are everywhere, and, that, you know, that's another reason. I didn't want to do a fucking a show on the same night all that shit came out because, you know what, yeah. you got to get all the best shit together. I want to give it a couple of days to settle because yeah. everybody's all over the fucking place with that shit. Let yep. the dust settle. <laughs> dust settle. Uh, ah! dust settle. Uh, we'll pun up, intended. We'll, you know, we'll, we'll try to get the best news and the best things we could talk about, and then, you know, we'll do it. We'll do it that way, you know. Hey, Uncle Dust, before you cut us out, show what us up? another photo of the, the bottles. What up? Show us another picture of the, you know. Oh, what's up? The bottles. Why? He wants, he wants to see your beer bottles. Yeah. He wants you to drink. <laughs> well, there's 12 empty and the two of the <laughs> So that's 14. That's, that's nothing, nice. man. That's that's so fucking 8 o'clock on an ETR night, man. What the it's fuck, 8 o'clock on an ETR you night. You think I'm a fucking... Come on, man. Come on. We rolling. We rolling. What about you? How many fucking uh, coffees you drink? I didn't, I didn't touch the coffee, but I had to refill the beverage twice. All right. Good for you, yeah. man. I mean, yeah. I know a hot liquor. I don't even know her. It's a little harder, man. I'm drinking some light beers because I'm trying to stay light. Nobody got anything on that one. All right. We're out of here. Yeah, totally. God. Fuck it. You we can watch laugh. Kenny, what are, you, what are you doing there, Kenny? Well, I'm just I'm hanging. Yeah, exactly. I'm hanging. Exactly. He's just quiet. <laughs> I'm, I'm just fucking hanging. Get, Kenny, you're that guy. We get nervous when you get quiet. So you're like, that's a plot. <laughs> Big motherfucker plotting some shit. Hmm. <laughs> so what's going on with Stasis Lock, man? Ah, I'm dude. You know, like I said uh, to you earlier, I was on this. Oh, this you did. I, I take. Uh, All right, I'm stopping the broadcast. Right no, I. Oh, okay. <laughs> like, uh, like, subscribe, share. Like, subscribe, share, guys. Yeah. Like, subscribe, yeah. share. Now I was on this, but I haven't been on in Realm. a good Realm. Six Realm. weeks or more. <laughs> yeah, that's. I heard they were like, like, like searching for you, but you know, it's you know the work shit, man. It sucked, yeah, because at work they changed. Uh, our truck days were Wednesday once a week. You know what? We don't so. want to hear about that. Oh, man. Dom's the <laughs> 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 Dom. so, no, We say Dom. fuck Dom, and now he shows up. Yeah, yeah, yeah look at Dom. 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 Dom.
Oh, Sounds like on, Beetlejuice. You say his fucking name three times. He shows up. Oh, my God. <laughs> Beetlejuice. Uh, <laughs> fuck you, Dom. Christ. Fuck, fuck Dom. Dom. Fuck Dom. Fuck Dom. Yeah, man. Yeah. Fuck Dom, man. That's how Dave calls me. What's up? Now he said it's a Dave calls him. Fuck, don't say Dave's name again. Get him. Don't say Dave's name three times. Energon. How's you guys doing? I'm sorry. I was uh, hanging out with the fam, and I, I jumped on. I heard you guys say, fuck Dom. I'm like, oh, that's the, I can't have that shit. Fuck Dom. I got to come <laughs> See, he is like Beetlejuice. Fuck. Yeah, uh, yeah we're, we're, you know, we're just wrapping this up. We're about to hit awesome. that button. But, you know, we're going to go unbroadcast it. So yep, anybody yep. wants to come in here and hang out, I'm sure we get another fucking two, three hours in this motherfucker. Dust Mites is going to sleep. <laughs> if we're lucky, maybe on camera. I don't know. We'll see. <laughs> you know what, Russ? When you have it happen like four times, you n- never again. I know. You get smart. I know. It's just never again. fuck. It's, it's, you know? it's kind of like, you know, the whole Tim K German thing, never again. ROC baby. ROC. Later, guys. Love you all. Later. Take care, guys. <laughs>